Lower Pog. Hey Wubby, can you pull up a YouTube video of what it looks like to pull a gold in a CS case? I'm dying to know what happens. I am pretty black tonight, smile. Dwayne, kiss me on the mouth. Thank. Cream pie me daddy. single ladies in chat? Two years let's go. Hey Wubby, thanks for always being there to call me retarded. Wubby I'm so happy to see you tonight. I hope you saw my Reddit post. Love you Papa.
to pump it up, don't you know? Pump it up, you got to pump it up, don't you know? Pump it up, you got to pump it up, don't you know? Pump it up, you got to pump it up. Wubby seven, wubby seven, wubby seven, wubby seven, wubby seven, wubby seven. Isra. Twenty one months. I can drink again. Love the content. Wubby. Boy, play the E song. Has raid, okay. Has raid. Has raid. Has raid. Has raid. Twenty nine months. And Thank you, Ham, for the raid. Lousy child po. Okay. Guys, I got something better than child po today. Where Trust me, I got something. I got something better. I'm I'm very liquidy. Is that a word? I'm very um. Does a book begin just to finish? I'm very lactating. What is it when it comes out of your mouth? I'm very lactating uh. Saliva. Salivating. Salivating. Gingerbread baker. Thank you for five. What's up, chat? Happy Wednesday! It's Wednesday. Dude, my days are all upside down. How's everyone doing? Pimp Lobs! Stay the vibe! Start over, you ruined it? Shut the fuck up. I'm drunk, Wubby. It's a, it's, bro, it's a Wednesday evening. What do you mean you're drunk? That's, you are, that's a problem. Just kidding. Haha, <laughs> keep getting drunk. Who cares? Nothing matters. Woo! Who cares? Nothing matters. Someone get this man his keys. Someone get this man behind the wheel now. Nearest freeway. I'm kidding. By the way, I'm kidding. Do not drive drunk. No excuses, people. Um Hello. Welcome to stream. Busy boy, thank you for the five. Appreciate you. Thank you guys. Hello. Got dude, we got a I don't know how today's stream is going to go, but God damn it if we didn't put work into it and God damn it if I'm not excited for it. Now, granted, just because I'm excited doesn't mean it's going to be great, but I'm I'm at, I'm looking forward to this. We got a you know, I'm just going to say I'm going to be brave. We got a good stream today, a stream that I think new viewers will get a lot out of and old viewers will get a lot out of for two for two totally different reasons. Today is the first ever Wubby Iceberg stream. What does that mean? Well, let me show, let me give you a sneak peek. What does it mean? Well, with the help of my incredibly hardworking and talented uh, assistant, producer, whatever you want to call him, Booty, my boy Booty Swagger, along with my mods, some, some close friends, some old frogs, we put together what I consider to be a somewhat comprehensive list. Didn't ask. All right, I'm gonna end stream. I'll see you guys on Friday. This Friday is Peel Box. We put together a, a, a comprehensive list of of, uh, of, 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 of of stream memes. Stream memes. This is, we have done, the only time we've done something similar to this is when we did the emotes stream, but this is going to be significantly more broad than that. Let me show you so here is a little taste, a little sneak peek, and we are, God willing, uh, God willing, producing. You produce this, booty. God willing, we're gonna get through all these points today. I, we have, I have an Excel, or I have a, a Google Doc spreadsheet with references to every single one. Uh, some of them have videos, some of them just have stories, some of them have just photos. Every single one of these, hopefully, we'll be able to get through. Some are lost to time, and I'm hoping when I bring them up, the thousands of you here, someone will have a reference to it. 
Um, but that's what we're doing on stream today. And more importantly, I want this to be uploaded in its entirety. We've been, if you guys remember, this stream idea is weeks old because somebody posted a iceberg on the subreddit and I was like, it'd be a good idea to go through all of those. So then we took a lot of that person's iceberg points. We flushed Didn't it ask. out. We made, we made it bigger. And uh, now here we are. All right. You remember? So hopefully we can just leave it on YouTube as a reference because I, I recognize a lot of this stream is just memes that like, uh, dude, so often I hear like, oh, I missed this stream and now I don't get this. I missed one stream last month because I had to bury my grandma's ashes. And so now, as a result, I I'm, I'm totally behind on like 18 things that happened. So hopefully this helps a little bit with it. You're not gonna ever get everything. There's way too much shit. Every stream has new shit, but uh, this will be fun. I can't stop highlighting messages. Why are you doing that? Stop doing that. You got me with it too, you fucker. For all my rage, thank you for the five. 13 also, God, I, I feel like I've, I feel, dude, uh, there's been a lot of streams this I'm week and most of you don't even know sucks. about them. So, so first off, I did a Monday stream, okay? Some of you were there, most of you weren't, but thanks, we did, it was a sponsored stream. Thank you, I had a lot of fun, basically like a podcast, that was good. And then today, I woke up at 10, God, I know, I know, to do, I was on Ms. Kiff's stream today, on Parasocial. And you know what, I carried, I hard carried my team. And, and I, you know what I'll say it, it was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun, we did lose. Uh, because my team threw, they were very bad. They will admit it themselves. Um, but I'll be honest, I had a lot of fun. And if you guys tune into that, you guys get, if you've tuned into everything this week, you're getting hella streams. This Friday's Peel Box. I mean, if you're tuning into all this, great week for you. I didn't advertise that I was going on Miskiff stream. It was extremely last minute. I found out yesterday. Uh, I missed, <laughs> something fucked up. I actually missed the DM of his. I big timed him. I accidentally big timed Miskiff. He asked me to come on, and then last night I, see, I get a notification that just says it's him pinging. He goes, "Hey, did you see this?" And I was like, "Oh fuck!" So last minute. Otherwise, I would have told you guys about it. I, I didn't know. Lost to Zed. I don't want to talk about it. You can go watch his vod. I personally think the vod is really funny. If they make like a highlight out of it, I think you guys should all go watch it. I had a lot of fun being on the show. I hope I get invited back. It was fun. Uh, and that's that. So that's what I did this morning. And now, uh, it's time, but before we get into the, before we get into the iceberg, I do have some things I want to talk about real quick. I did tell you guys that I, 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 a lot of people think I'm privileged. A lot of people think I'm, I'm, I'm cushy. I got a lot of yes men around me, but let me tell you, I have suffered. I, uh, something happened to me last night that, that caused immense suffering. <laughs> and I just want to vent a little bit. I just want to, I just want to uh, explain a little bit. I want to, I want to. You know, there's no punchline to this story that I'm about to tell you. There's no big ending. I just want to share my hurt with with the people I think would care, which is why I'm not gonna tell it on stream. I'm gonna I'm gonna go talk to somebody else off stream. Dude, where are my socks? Stick them the five. No, okay. So I, as you guys know, yeah, this is my personal 9/11. This is I, this is what I imagine like New Yorkers feel like. I, I feel the same way now. I feel like we can bond over this trauma. So let me explain. As you guys know, I'm really interested in Lego uh, recently. It's my new like autism ADD focus, okay? Super, super into Lego. Don't care. Plus you're white, okay? End it all. Thank you, second favorite shirt for the five. Appreciate you, brother. Need that. I need that. So I've been into Lego recently. I built the Eiffel Tower. Huge, one of the biggest Legos. Insane. A lot of repetitive building, but I did it. And then I built the Porsche. Okay, the 911. I built the Porsche. Built that, done, easy. And then I th said, okay, let's, what's the next one? And I found this grand piano. It's another huge one. It's a big old grand piano. And I've just been building it in my off time, having fun, right? Uh, last night, I was getting close to finishing it up. I'm probably three-fourths done. Most of the piano is together at this point. All the... If you guys don't know, it's a playable piano. It's got like a motor on the inside, all these crazy little internals so you could look at it. It's a very cool piano. Put it, putting the finishing touches, I'm, I'm probably three quarters of the way, maybe four fifths of the way through. <clears throat> and I'm going to snap a piece on and it's on this little table. I have it on an elevated table and I'm up here doing it. And unfortunately, the piano is held up by uh, a stand 
that's on wheels. It's like a real piano. You move it around. <gasps> and I go to snap a piece in, <clears throat> and I think I gave it a little too much oomph without enough support. The piano got out from under me and just fell, turned upside down, top heavy, and smashed into the floor. And poggers! My mother was shot in front of me after, uh, well, both my mother and father were outside of a theater when I was a child. We went to see a play, an opera. Rarely do. In fact, we haven't since because they're dead. My mother and father were both shot in front of me outside of an opera when I was a child. Batman. And, and nothing prepared me for the feeling of the, 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 the Lego crashing to the Poggers. floor. Why are people saying Zora? Why are you saying Poggers? This is so mean. I want you guys to understand something. I realized in that moment that I have not suffered enough in my life because for maybe like four hours after that, I was on the verge of tears. Let me explain. So I pick it up like a, like a, like, like, I, I, I can't even describe. It was in absolute disarray. And you know what's worse about it too? This is a $500 Lego and it's not simply, oh, just put it back together. You don't know. Yeah, it's like John Wick's puppy. Exactly. Exactly like John Wick's puppy. You don't know anyone, anyone who, anyone who builds Legos understands the trauma right now. You don't know where to put the pieces. It's not follow the instructions again. I don't know what's broken, but everything's broken. I'm sitting here looking at little chunks of like eight pieces together. I'm like, where the fuck does this go? I had a meltdown. I'm not lying. I, I had a legitimate meltdown. I just stood up. I put on some shorts and I went to the gym. I went straight to the fucking gym. I couldn't even think straight. I'm at the gym. I'm not even lying. I start getting emotional. You want to know something really weird about how unstable I am? I start thinking, I'm never going home. <laughs> I'm going to leave it all behind me. This is it. I'm just going to run away. <laughs> I'm at the gym, dude. I swear to God, I'm at the gym. I'm doing shoulders. That was yesterday. I'm doing shoulders at the gym. And I'm sitting there thinking, if I don't go home, I don't have to deal with it. <laughs> Because all I could picture was going, walking back into the house and seeing the mess because it, nothing would be solved. It would just be right there. I'll have you guys know that I know, I know this is, this is going to be hard to believe. I did overcome my demons. I did eventually go home. Let's be honest. The longest gym session of the year though. A lot of sitting around. A lot of, maybe if I just, maybe, maybe. Maybe Booty will just throw it away. If I if I leave for a few months, maybe he'll get tired of it taking over most of the couch and just throw it away, right? Maybe it'll disappear. <laughs> this single-handedly proves your autism. I'll be honest with you. You know what sucks? When you're sad and, and devastated over something stupid, if you're rational, like I consider myself to be, you get more sad and devastated over how pathetically devastated I was. So I'm in this like loop of self-hating because why the fuck am I mad at myself over a fucking Lego? And now I'm mad at myself for being sad. And then, then you calm down and then you go, my Lego's broken. That's true. <laughs> so I'm just in this loop of like, adults don't get mad at Lego. But I'm about to cry. Why are you crying? Adults don't cry over plastic. <laughs> but it's so much work. So, Log Diggity, thank you for the 50. Salty Caesar, thank you for the 10. So I want you guys to know I didn't cry very much. Appreciate the subs. Appreciate the subs. Seriously, guys, thank you. So I, I got home. And, man, dude, let me tell you how this went, right? Go st it was like I was fighting. Like, I, I felt like I was in a, like, like in a bad fight with my wife. Like, that's how it felt. Like, I, went, I got home and I just slammed my door. For who, by the way? Who is this? Who am I mad at? I go home, slam my fucking door in my room. I'm just sitting in my room. I'm looking at the floor and I'm like, I gotta go deal with it. I gotta go deal with it. Walk out, walk out, see just the mess, walk away. Every time I see it, I'm living all over again. For who? Yeah, who is this for? So, event, and, and you know what's funny? You guys don't see this side of me. I mean, I was just like, I was sad, man. It's so pathetic. So, eventually, I muster up the strength to go out there and look and assess the damage. The, I mean, it's, it's smashed. It's fucked, right? It is what was once a beautiful grand piano missing its top is now a crumbled mess of pieces. So I calm down, I get less sad, and I make it a challenge. And after, I'll say this, took me three hours, chat, 
but the piano is back to its glory. However, here is what's, you want to know what's driving me mental right now? Okay. It was, it was grueling. It was a lot of like memory of like, okay, I, I kind of remember how this piece was. Let me look at the book. Okay. And like kind of visual, it was a lot of weird shit. Do you want to know what's fucking, actually, I'm going to go grab it. Hold on. I'm going to show you something. Hold on, hold on. I'm going to show you what's haunting me right now. Hold on. Okay, here's what's haunting me. I didn't bring the piano. I'm not touching that shit. Okay? So, it all functions. Still works great. The motor works. The keys work. It looks perfect. What are you for? Where the fuck do you go? This... <sighs> and it is not through lack of... Where what? I... I and I look, this is two pieces, by the way, two, here, where do you go? Where do you exist? What is it for? What is it for? You know? <laughs> what is it for? <laughs> Foot pedal. <sighs> here's what I'm going to tell you. Here, here, here's, here's what I'm going to say right now. Here's what I'm going to say right now. Uh, if I find what it's for, I'll let you guys know. If someone wants to be really autistic and look through the book. <laughs> I did page 80 Motherfuckers in chat saying page 81 page 67. No, you're lying You're lying. I'm gonna give it a day before I start believing the pages But is there just some fucking rain man in my chat? Oh, that's actually page 82 step 363 That's square a little bit on top of triangular bit yeah, easy That's Lego code 69272 two, four. easy done page 45 I'm serious? Okay, if I get, okay, you're serious. If I get back up and go to the motherfucking living room right now, okay, and I grab the book and I come back and it's not on the page, I will end stream. Are you serious still? Huh? The iceberg is melting, Wubby, please. Can you let me, can you let me just have this, please? Dude, I, I just want to vent with you guys, bro. It's fucking heartbreak. You don't even know, it's heartbreak. You wanna, can I tell you how heartbreaking it is? I'm going to reenact for you at dropping. Okay? Shh, crashes. You want to know my initial reaction? It's this. Ready? I think I was stuck there for maybe five minutes. I mean, I was just... <sighs> you know, you, you ever get so fucked up, you just, you, just, you just sit there? You know? Like I said, both my mother and my father and my grandma, my cat, and my brother, and my sister... We all went to the opera and it was, it, it was crazy. We went outside and all of them got shot mercilessly in front of me. And I, they made, they even at one point, the, one of the crooks made me pull the trigger and nothing compared me to dropping my grand piano. Hot bears. Why? Wubby for real, it's on page six. No, I'm grabbing the book. I'm grabbing the book. I'm grabbing the fucking book. Mods? Hot bears. Keep an eye out for who said page 63. Mods, do it! You're funny. Alright. I got the book! Uh-oh, Dad's mad now. Alright, here we go! Alright, huh? Grand piano, huh? Someone said 63. Right, let's go to page 63. Okay. 63. Nope. Nope. Not even fucking close, dude. Nope. Nope. What else you got? 73? It's on page 73. Dick's enough. What? 73. Okay, I'm going to 73. They're saying no joke 73. Why do I even fucking... But you're not even... 73 is so off. It's fucking gears, you dingle idiots. Step 73. Okay, wait, hold on, wait, hold, step 70, oh, wait, wait, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute, oh my god, wait, are you guys right? Hold on, wait a minute, hold on. <laughs> what? Oh my god, what? I could cry. Oh my god, no way, look, 
Oh my god, what? Look at look look if you guys are wondering 73 there it is and then there's a little back pit <laughs> Oh my god <clears throat> I'm getting kind of choked up bro I need to know who found that first. I want to buy you a Lego set. Whoever found that, I don't know if we can figure that out. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's start from the top here real quick, Odd. I oh. My name is Walter Hardwell White, and I live at. Oh, I'm not gonna say the street. I'd like to issue a former formal. I'd like to issue... Hello. My name is Wubby. I'd like to issue a formal apology to chat. I thought they were trolling me. Hi, you bears! <laughs> Your guys' uh, uh, autism and attention to detail know no bounds, so I appreciate that, chat. And I mean that a lot. I'm, it almost got me choked up. It's a Didn't little... Ask. I don't care, plus you're white. Thank you. <sighs> Whoever got it, seriously though, whoever got it, legit... If, if, if we can hey figure buddy, out who... I hope that piano gets built back you up suck. again soon. You got this, man. Thank you, guys. Autism skill tree maxed out. <laughs> who found that so weird, dude? It was me, Wubby. Oh, it's oh, a lot of it was me. So sick of people hating on One Piece just because they can't fucking watch the anime. David R. Kelly, thank you for the five. Uh, Salty Caesar, thank you. And Lord Diggity, the 50. Crazy, bro. To One Piece. Go jerk off to your 3,000-year-old demon girls who look five. All right, uh, cool, uh, dude. It's on the subreddit. <laughs> what the fuck? Apes together strong. Metard, utard, retard nation. Metard, utard, retard nation. All right. Uh, before we get into the iceberg, I have one last thing to to bring to you guys' attention. We all know you guys. You, we all know how you guys feel about Black Little Mermaid. Am I right, guys? But I, for one, don't care. But I do want to share something else with you because it's gone too far this time. Okay. First, we have Clea. Let's call her Clea Blackstra. First, we have Cleopatra. Okay. But, chat, I'm going to introduce you to what is, in my opinion, the absolute. This is the moment. This is what all these people have been warning us about. Let me introduce you to, from the new Little Mermaid movie, okay? The new look of our beloved fish friend, Flounder. Oh, God. Bro, ain't no way. Bro, ain't no way. I lit. Okay, so, guys, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. They killed my boy with Down syndrome, bro. What happened? Man, God damn. What happened, bro? What they do? What they do? Like, listen, guys. Yeah, okay. There's, there's people being mad about Black Little Mermaid. There's people being mad about White Little Mermaid. There's people. Be Can we all do the hand, the multiracial handshake, and say, "Fuck this, please, God"? What do they do? They ca they're calling him Flounder. Oh wait, that's his name. <laughs> anyway, the. <vo> <laughs> Uh, he got the flound syndrome, you know what I'm saying? Uh, no, this shit, I saw, okay, I saw this on Twitter, and I went, that's not fucking real, that is, uh, that's bait, that is, people made that because that is so terrible, that is bait, and then I looked it up, this is a real poster, at least, unless I got totally got, this is a real poster that Disney put out for Flounder, this is real, this is real, they're calling him Steve Buscemi the Flatfish, is what they're calling him. <sighs> the original isn't a flounder either. I don't care. I don't care. Listen, this is we, we listen. Okay, make Little Mermaid black. Make her what? I don't give a fuck. Don't do this to the fish, bro. Do not do that. I guess he's just a fish, right? Right? Like it's a it's a literal fish, bro. Clown syndrome. Come on. Justice for flounder. I but I. <laughs> 
I, I can't wait to see how he like moves and talks. It's 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 actually just it's absurd, isn't it? What's Sebastian? Wait, there's a Sebastian? Hold on. We know what Sebastian looks like. Little mermaid. Live. You guys know what Sebastian looks like already? No, you don't. Where is he? You're tripping. Did did no, this is this is fake. This is apps. This is hogwash, brother. This is hogwash. This has got to be fake. This is no, 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 no. This is fake. This is comedy. This is a parody. Bro, it's a crab. <laughs> no, cut this. No, this is not. This is so stupid, dude. I don't even care about Little Mermaid. By the way, one, literally below one of the. Not even mid, below mid Disney princess movies. Little Mermaid is trash. Make her whatever you want. I don't give a fuck. It's terrible. This is just so, this is so stupid. What the fuck, bro? You know what this reminds me of? It's like the, um, how the Lion King, King uh, the live action Lion King, if you want to call it that. Like the CG one that was made by Chef Guy. Right? Where he just ruined it all. But he's like, no, no, they kind of look like real lions because you don't understand. That's what people want. It's just a crab, bro. It's like nobody wanted this. It's it's a cheesy princess movie, nothing too bad. Oh, dude, don't make it real. I'm just laughing at how ridiculous this looks. I mean, come on, come on, listen, we can't deny that's the most ridiculous look of the shit you've ever seen. Also, yeah, I I is was okay, now this might be ignorant. Is he a lobster? I thought he was a lobster. Am I stupid? Is he a crab? No, he's a lot. No, he's a crab. Okay, that's fine. I listen. <coughs> I guess not. I guess not. God, he looks so bad. I'm sorry. He looks terrible. How are they going to sell plushies of this? You know, what's that going to look like? He was a hermit crab. Oh, you're right, actually. Aristos, thank you for the 10. Dude, I'm trying to eat. Did I ruin it? Hey, Whoopi. It's your resident Jew here. Just want to let you know that the person who helped you with your Lego issue is D. Mooch. He's a Lego nerd with a basement filled with this shit. He gave me the Lego shuttle at Spin in NYC when we were there. Probably VIP him. D. Mooch. Was it really D. Mooch? I'm going to need proof on that because anyone can play audio. But D. Mooch. D. Mooch. He can confirm him. Just D. Mooch. Oh, buddy. Uh, dude, first off, I'm sorry if I ever made fun of Lego. I get it, man. You know what it is? It's 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 uh it's uh it's my it's like my late night meditation. I just get so in the zone, and I, I it's, it's oh man, I get it, bro. I totally get. It. I'm not looking at my phone, by the way. I'm actually changing the AC. I don't have to get up anymore for that. You know why? Because I finally set it up. How many years I've been living here? Uh, Foxy Molly, thank you for the five, Foxy Molly. Appreciate you. Tip the fedora. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <clears throat> two years, yeah, two years. Uh, check Disney Twitter for pics of the characters, guys. We got it. We really gotta get going on the stream That's here, true. though. We I got a lot to do, and I don't know if we're gonna get through it all. Uh, but Demuch, seriously, man, that was uh, that was awesome of you, and I, I I appreciate you helping and knowing. It means so much. It doesn't make a difference on the actual Lego. This was just like a mental battle I was dealing with. Okay, wait, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on the, I'm on Disney's Twitter. Let's, let me, let me see if, make sure I don't get like jump scared with a big black penis. All right, yep, here it is. Here we go, here we go. Okay. Ariel, okay, cool, whatever. Ursula, pretty good. Pretty, I would say it's pretty, nailed it as far as Ursula looks. King Triton. Okay, so Ariel's uh, mom is black. Okay. Prince Eric, okay. I mean, this is just, this is so bad, bro. This is so bad, bro. Ursula looks less chubby. Yeah, whatever. I don't even remember this character. I don't know anything about, I don't know. Is this, a, was there a bird in the movie? I don't know. <laughs> I told, guys, I told you it's real. I told you it's fucking real, bro. <coughs> it's, I'm, come on. Bro, it's going to be everyone's Discord profile picture. That's so bad. What else we got? Okay, that's it. These are stunning. Are you for real right now? Is this are you, did this bring you to this brought you to tears? Wait, I kind of want to be him, and then we got to do this. Hold on, I kind of want to be him, and then we'll do the we'll do the stream. Just let me give me a second.
Thank you. Thank you. Hey, thank you, everybody. Hey, thanks for coming to stream tonight, boys. Oh, oh. All right. So, without further ado, it's time to start the Wubby Iceberg stream. Uh, once again, I'm going to give a huge shout out to Booty Swagga, who worked late into the night getting all these together. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Uh, and I guess we just, uh, do you guys just want to get started? It's time for the, Alu, the sper Flounder literally looks like Burger Planet. Wow, wow, wow love you. Wow. <laughs> Bro, that's so true. Holy shit, that's not, you're not wrong at all, love actually. You, that's crazy. You. It wow, but I don't look like Chai that, do I? All the fluff wubby pog. I think that really it's a good clear separation there. We can really tell. By the way, new flavor of uh, uh gamer subs coming out on Friday. Trevor it's the one I've been sipping Trevor. that I've been advertising that you guys can't get, which I didn't realize. If it comes out Friday, red raspberry. I'll be promoting it on Friday as well. I glad as well. Not my flavor, Thanks by the, the way. Content. But it is still good. Also yeah, shut your pants. <clears throat> Happy 29th. All right, so the I just bought my first house. Oh, let's see. Oh, you bought your first house? No Congrats. That Congrats. That cool. So I think the way I'm going to have to do this, let me see what I can do here. 37 month lore. All right, I think I'm just gonna leave the. Oh, oh. God Thank in you, heaven! Baby. Keep it up, buddy. You make life less lonely. Thank you. Let's Bro, go. Shut baby. up. Shut the hell up, your mouth. Wubby Let seven. Me. Wubby seven. Wubby seven. I did it. Smile. Okay, let's do this. A wub cup is born. Dude, I saw some appreciation posts on the subreddit, which made me really happy. I'm glad you guys uh, uh appreciate how fucking amazing I am. So thank you. All right. The Wubby Iceberg uh, starts now. I guess we, we're going to go to the top here. We'll start at the top, uh, which is... God, this is way too big of an image. I, not against you, Booty. I'm just realizing I don't know how to show this. What the fuck is the language of the slaves, bro? Oh, God. All right, we're going to be here a while. All right, chat. Uh, <clears throat> we have videos from... Okay, Pope Wubby. This is going to be the... This one is... Okay, the whole first layer is shit that's even happened recently on stream. Uh, so you probably know it, Pope Wubby. Uh, I did a confession stream, as many of you guys know. Uh, here is that. Here's the confession stream. You've seen clips of it. Here I am walking out. Okay. Pope Wubby. Uh, I think Pope Wubby was a lot of people's introduction to me. It's my most viewed video, I think. 2.3 mil. I just want to see me flick the vodka in her mouth. I hated this beard combo. I feel like it aged me. Like, literally, like, ten years. God, this was so scuffed. So thrown together, too. Here it is. Yep, yep. <laughs> Wait, is that a Lego? We gotta build that one, too. All right, so that's Pope Wubby. God, how highlight? Actually, I'm not even gonna show most of these, because you guys know the first layer. Is that fair? Can we all agree? I'll show the ones that aren't as common. All right? High Life You Lose. You know what High Life You Lose is. We post one once a month. Green screen suit. Now, is this the origins of the green screen suit? <coughs> <coughs> All right, this one's going to be a little fun little thing, which I have shown before, but I might as well show now. So the green screen suit, although it is something you see every stream, here is the origins of it. I hope this is time stamped. I think it should be fine, though. Okay, so let me explain this clip. Dr. Dankenstein, MD! Why is Earl spelt Earl? Bro, bro, can you? You're getting ahead. Get in the hand. No songs, no hand. <clears throat> so this, by the way, to who, to those who thought I didn't, that I was a Counter-Strike trend hopper. Nope. Back when I was a Who Mega Lol. 28 subs. I had 28 friends. Okay. Uh, I was still playing Counter-Strike. And this, this scene is, um, by the way, a lot of talking today on stream. A lot of yapping. It is what it is. P.O. Box is going to be Friday if you prefer that. So this one I am going to go into detail about lore. Because I think this is what people want out of this stream, right? If you, if you want to watch the lore stream, you're going to want to hear the lore. So, uh, I ordered, when I still, I had a real-ass job, and I was doing streaming on the side. Well, the Jigglypuff only has three syllables. I ordered a green screen, and it was getting delayed. So I ordered a green screen suit, uh, and I, I rocked that without a green screen for a, a, a few, a lot of streams, actually. I ordered a... I was wearing just a green screen suit and no green screen. Then eventually the green screen got here and I was just using that. And then somebody in chat, I don't know who it is. Somebody in chat said, why don't you do the green screen and the green screen suit? And this is the first moment ever on stream uh, 
of that happening. And you can actually, I love this clip too, because you can see my face go, oh, that's kind of funny. Right when I turn on the green screen. <laughs> this is so... There it is! There it is! I love that this moment is captured, and, and more importantly, I love that this moment still exists. We lost a lot of clips to a DMCA purge, uh, I think like last year or something. Um, so yeah, this is all on YouTube. You can check this out if you want, but it's really boring. Watch, okay, watch this, watch this, watch this comedy. Watch how the comedy has grown. Ready for this? Watch this, watch this, ready? Sandwich bit coming up. So if I was to take a bite of my sandwich right now, would it just be a floating sandwich? <clears throat> the birth of a hero. The birth of a hero. So there you go. That's the green screen. Right? I mean, right? Kind of, right? Come on. Come on. Actual child. I mean, yeah. like, as far as, like, I know we hold early 20-year-olds to a standard of being an adult. I know. And as we should. Fine. Okay, whatever. But when I look at that, that was early 20s Wubby. That's a child. That's a child. Sorry. It's a child. It just straight up is. I know. I know. I know. Uh, whatever. You know right from wrong, sure. But I look at that Wubby, I, I can say that about me. I look at him and I go, that's a fucking child. Like he was, he had no clue how the world worked. And even I don't. All right. I'm 21, fresh out the womb. <clears throat> Bro, the problem with that when I was 21 is that I thought I knew it all. That's the problem with being 21. You think you know it all. All right. Uh, 5 8. Let me see if we have anything reference for this. Some of these are just straight up stories with no clips at all. Uh, yep, 5 8's empty. So, 5 8, yep. Uh, old meme, very, very old meme in my chat. Not my height. Not real. Not actually my height. As you guys know, everyone always says it. The first thing when they meet me, they say, Well, you're not actually 5 8. I know. There's someone just said, Holy Kappa, dude. Listen, listen. I will say it is an old meme that was started when my community was like a group of friends, right? When my community was like 20 people. They were like, yeah, Wubby's 5'8". All right, moving on from that one, we have The Gong, which, let's see what the origin of this one is. I mean, I know, what clip do we have here? All right, we have an archive clip. So a lot of these archive clips uh, were either found by me, my mods, or Peanut, Carlos, or Booty. This one I did not find, so I don't know what this is gonna be. Oh, is this the Gong reveal? This is the Gong reveal stream. Look at that young Wubby, dude. Oh my god! Oh, it's so weird to see! Why am I zooming in on that, bro? Hey, son, can we go back to the fish stream? No. So young, so smooth. Look at the hair, too. Oh my god. And I put, I put band-aids over the nipples. You look 14. <clears throat> yeah, dude. Time, alcohol, and money, they'll all age you. So there you go. All right, there you go. Well, you look 45 now. You guys are really being mean to me. And I could do I could do without it. No eyebrows? Whatever. Um, okay, you cringe your drink. You know what that is? Odd jobs. You guys know what those are? Both both two shows that have been recently. We do cringe your drink once a month. Odd jobs is our show that we're working on. We have another episode that's gonna be coming out eventually. Uh Earlt! Earl, do we have anything for Earl or is that one an explanation too? These are all the early ones. They're not that interesting. Okay. Uh, Earl, I actually don't know why you guys are call called Earl. I don't remember the history of the name, but I can tell you what Earl is. You look like Earl that guy you hate. Earl is the early chat that hangs out pre-stream. Uh, they go, sometimes they're there hours before, but usually it's like an hour before stream and they listen to music and there's like branches of Earl 2 now that are like Puzzle Gang and like Earl, I mean, there's like an official Earl, but I'm talking about like the general like Earl chat um, is what I'm more so talking about. And they, there's like DJs and music. People hang out in my chat before stream starts. I think it's very cute. I enjoy it. Oh, wait, wait, uh, Breezy said, I got you erotic Tom spelled early wrong one day. We all rushed in to say early, so we mocked him. There you go. There you go. See, I knew you guys would come in with lore that I don't actually have. All right, Fear Pong. Fear Pong, you guys know, was a stream we did uh, with Miko and, and, and Minx, and Alex and I also did one. We have a clip from it. Here we go. <coughs> Is this a good clip? Is this gonna be I'm so sorry. Wait, I just, hold, on, hold on. She's not racist. She's wearing a sign that has the I, I want to make it clear. We are 
All right, we're going to move past. Dude, this stream is a fever dream, and I can't believe we did it. Um, but it's cool to see that it exists. All right, Farquad. I actually have a story about Farquad. The Farquad meme. So many of you probably don't even know where it comes from, and it's not really a meme anymore. It kind of pops up once a media share. Tony Pepperoni! All right, so what's Farquad? So Farquad is something I came up with that makes no sense. Charzo! Farquad was me and my friends were hanging out and for no reason i thought it would be funny to start sending them shit act like it's urgent and when they click to reveal it it's just a jpeg of lord farquad and then i would say oh you got farquaded right this became a thing in my friend group i don't know why there's no explanation it just came from my brain okay then i brought that to stream i farquaded stream and chat loved it took it over and it became a thing where we would donate videos we would we would uh, i bought a cardboard cutout of it that cost a lot of money getting far quoted i'd say this meme has kind of died now some people still do it it definitely shows that you've been watching for a while if you mention far quad a lot of subs just came in i don't know why sally disco thank you for the five pay watcher bomb with 50 jesus christ does chat know about getting deweyed <laughs> getting deweyed i don't know if i ever brought that one to stream Getting Deweyed is the is the Farquad of off stream. Farquad took over stream and Dewey is I, I Dewey people all the time, bro. Oh, you get Deweyed. Oh, getting there's nothing worse than getting Dewey, and it's a specific photo of Dewey. I'll pull it up for you guys. Uh, welcome in the middle. I will pull it up. It's a specific. You say, oh, check this out, and then you send him this instead of. Okay, hold on. I gotta find it. Give me a second. Give me a second. It's called getting Deweyed. It's not as funny. That's fine. That's fine. That, that's why I kept it off stream. You gotta, you gotta watch out, you can get deweyed. Why is it not, hello? All right, here we go. So this is this is what getting deweyed is. Get far quoted! Oh, you idiots! Oh, you idiots! You just walked right into that one, didn't you? You thought I didn't have it. You thought I didn't have it, but I still got it, bro. <laughs> idiots, dude. Anyway, no, but getting deweyed was something we did off stream. Uh, but yeah, get far quoted. Probably the last Farquad I will ever do, and you got to be everyone called it. You Someone suck. just said you got me, so whatever. Babe Watcher Bob, thank you again for the 50, bro. You're crazy, you're mad, show us your balls, you're gross, you're crazy. Nyquist, thank you, brother. Chief Alexander, thank you for the 10. All right, let's keep going. Uh, Farquad, Arabic Couch, you guys know Arabic Couch. Um, I want to do more with it, but I will give you a little bit of a... Actually, this little animated video gives all the backstory you need. And I know some people don't know it, so here is the backstory for Arabic Couch. Someone on the subreddit posted, why is Wubby not addressing Arabic Couch? And there was a top reply and it said, I think he's just waiting for chat to forget. Here's what's gonna happen. The Arabic Couch is gonna show up. It's gonna be in pieces. Maybe off stream, Booty will assemble it and it'll be brought to this room. Then the stream will start. It'll be my room, no green screen. You'll see an Arabic Couch. I'll walk in the room with this playing. <laughs> I'll likely come in in some weird, offensive Middle Eastern garb that I will hide behind the fact that my dad is Middle Eastern to get a pass from, okay? I'll sit <laughs> on the couch, chat you will suck. be going crazy, and then guess what? Then nothing. I will have spent $200 on a bit that lasts 10 seconds that nobody even cares about in 10 years. 10 out of 10 content. Okay, fuck, I'm buying the Arabic couch right now. I'm not even lying. Bro, it's $1,200? This is so stupid. So, we ended up buying, so the couch was a stupid stream thing, whatever, people wanted me to buy it. I ended up buying it and I did a multi-hour long stream. I did a multi-hour long stream that was just the couch. And look at chat going feral in, in, in the side there. Look at them. This was it. At one point I threw rice on it. We brought in a couple boxes. So there you go. That is the Arabic couch lore. And I think we'll be adding more to that soon, but we'll see. All right. Um, Turd Kebab, a video on my main channel where I, I deep dive uh, a, a poop or maybe food. You guys can watch that whole video. Like I said, we're not going to spend too much time on the early ones. Cheeto is dead. Uh, that's a good one. <clears throat> Let's do that one. So, uh, uh, people hadn't seen my cat Cheeto in a while, so they assumed he had passed away. Um, 
And here is the earliest video we have. Oh, why are you so loud? Here's the earliest video we have of Little Cheeto that we found. I thought I'd show you this. Check this out. Look at this. Look at this. Check this out. <laughs> so there he is. That's that's the earliest we have of little guy. People didn't see him for a while, so they assumed he was dead. Uh, and maybe he is, maybe he isn't. I don't know. All right. Price is scuffed. Uh, you guys uh, know we've done three of these now. But the first one ever was filmed at, at my house. And here is a cool little intro from it. Also, credit to Jeems for this video. I used a lot of community videos for this. Uh, here's a little intro from the first Price is Scuff ever. It was a production we did where we basically parried the Price is Right, and it turned into a whole thing, and I'm proud of where we ended up with it. But here is the little intro for the first Price is Scuffed. What we got? Long. Hold. I key and J. All right. <laughs> yes! So there you go. You can watch the whole thing on YouTube. There's the price of scuffed. Uh, Cult of the Lamp, which will be very relevant uh, in the future with something that we're doing. But Cult of the Lamp was a stream from a Toronto Airbnb where... Uh, hold on. Okay, so this is... I remember correctly. Why did we use Black Squidward as the... This seems so not okay. Anyway, Cold Lamp was a stream live from a Toronto Airbnb where uh, I don't know why we did this, but we set up a camera. I don't remember the motivation. We set up a camera looking down outside of the Airbnb uh, just to see what would happen. It was like street cam. And uh, we had a scary homeless person uh, uh, vibing. And eventually uh, viewers started like moths to the flame, started gathering around this lamp here. And we monitored them all night. And it was a whole thing. And look, look, there he is. There he is. There he is. Cheering, having a good time. It was a whole thing. It became a, uh, eventually, it became a religion. Look at, look at them. Look at how weird they are. But it was really fun. Eventually, people started making it a, uh, submitting it to be a religious site. And then more and more started popping up around the United States and then around the world. And then Google got mad and took them all down. Uh, you're, well, you're not as red now. <laughs> well, th thank you, I guess. Uh, Will Rowe made a song about it, too. Uh, and there you go. Uh, uh, what did you say? We blindfolded someone and led them around the Airbnb. What a fever dream of a stream that was, but God damn it, it made for one of the greatest uh, memories on this list. Okay, uh, uh, called Lamp uh, Spelling Bee. We have Spelling Bees on our, on our highlight channel. I'm not going to pull those up. Game Show, Game Show. We also have, we did a Game Show, Game Show. We did multiple of them with General Sam on the highlight channel. Well, Billionaire. Uh, do we have a good clip for this one? Another Game Show we did. Some of you maybe have forgotten about these. Um, let's see. We do Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Oh, God. Is this just the whole thing? Yeah, there you go. So we did Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? I like this. We've done this with a few people. We've done this with this guy. The lamp. Touch the lamp. Be the lamp. Steal the lamp. We did this with Nuka Zeus. We did this. I think even Amaranth was on one, and I still owe her money for it. Um, but that's fine. We don't talk about that. Demooch, thank you for the five. All right, uh, P.O. Box streams. We're doing one of those this Friday, hopefully. Uh, we're doing one this Friday, so I'll see you guys there. Pegging. Pegging. Don't know why this one ended up here, but I guess let's... I'm, you know what? I'm not going to self-report here. I'm just going to see what clip was chosen here and go from there. Have you been pegged? No. That is not true. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. I, do, I do remember that. Well, we had a lie detector lady who was a hack fraud, loser idiot who lied. And um, and that's that. I've never been pegged. 
<clears throat> All right, Phil Kid Friday. We did one recently, as you guys know. Phil Kid Friday is an old stream bit that we used to do almost every stream uh, where I will play Fortnite, and on Fortnite, you can choose to fill, which brings somebody into your party, and we would fill to try to find a kid, and that was too many words, so we changed it to fill kids on a Friday. Uh, and that's something we used to do all the time. We did one recently, and it was shitty and boring, and who cares? All right. Uh, small eyes. I don't think we have a clip for this one, too, because there is no clip. You guys are just being mean. Man, this one says self-explanatory, and then he links an image. What is this image of? Is this going to be mean? It. This is so mean. Bro, it says small eyes, and then it's a fucking image from today when I was on Ms. Kiff stream. It says self-explanatory with an image. I'll try to give some context here. This is so mean, but uh, I, I don't know when this happened. I think it's when I started taking my glasses off and showing you guys myself without glasses. And people in chat go, you have really small eyes, which I don't. It's because when someone takes off their glasses, people get, you know, they realize like, oh, it looks smaller. I will show you right now. It's jarring. Okay, here's my eyes. I'm not opening them wide either. This is just me sitting naturally. Like I would watch TV like this. Okay. Now here, the, here it is with the glasses off. Ready? See what I mean? They're not small at all. <clears throat> Someone said you. All right. Uh, Wubby Wave. The wave hand uh, thing, I believe. That comes from my tiny hands, which I used to use all the time. I no longer really use them. That was when I was still, like, super into green screen jokes but uh tiny hands because you can't see my hands i always wanted to point at things this is a foot by the way look it looks like i have a little feet uh wrong wait wrong wait 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 wait. oh it's the microwave oh that's let what we left what we right oh what we wave is the microwave thank you booty thank you whole dude i don't even watch stream anymore i fell off uh what we wave is the microwave you are correct sorry my mistake i'm stupid i don't know what i'm talking about fake fan i stopped watching um Wubby Wave is the microwave. Do we have a clip for that? Do we have a clip for that? Hold on. Wubby. We should. Oh, we have an image. We have an image. Is this it? Is this it? Hold on. It's loading. We have an image for this one. Hold on. It's loading. We have an image for this one. Hold on. It's loading. We have an image for this one. Hold on. It's we do. We do have the thing I was looking for. All right. So this uh, was introduced in a P one of my first ever P.O. Box unboxing streams. Somebody sent me a bunch of these little shitty microwaves, right? And I use them in my videos. I use them in my uh, streams. I made them an emote. It became a meme. Eventually, I signed them and gave them away. So now a few people in chat own them i don't know what happened to them i personally own one of them still that i will always hold on to i don't know who else owns the other ones but they're out there you took this youtube video down that makes sense i probably said super horrible gamer words um but yeah there you go uh we used it i think this is still one of my sub notifications i think one of my og ones this was my sub notification for a very long time too so there you go wubby wave uh ancient ancient lore there uh, but still common. The microwave lore is common. Pancake stream. Listen, me and the boys jerked off in a tent on stream. Okay? You can go watch it if you want. Very recently, we're probably going to do another one. Wubby's Cane's order. This is mean. This is offensive. I'm going to talk about this one very briefly. When I go to Cane's, okay, I... Ooh, growing uh, up... What's with the eyesight? Are we going to Cold Stone Creamery? Growing up, I, uh, you know, there was never enough food despite being fat. So when it was your birthday, you know, you get a couple slices, right? You get what you get, right? You, you, everyone's got to share. When we'd go out to eat, you're, sh you're sharing your plate. Okay, hold on. We got TTS here. here can I have the Caniac combo and can I replace the slaw with extra fries? And can I have six pieces of toast and uh, 15 sauces and a Coke Zero? Man, you guys want to just start ordering for me, bro? Like, God damn. So, there's the context. Get to know me a little bit better. But long story short, now when I go to Cane's, okay, and I'm usually picking up food for more than just me. I'm usually getting food for whoever I'm with, the house, multiple people, okay? All right? And when I go, I don't like people going, is there any more bread? I don't want to fight for sauces. So, you know what I do? I blanket it. Yeah, we are always left with leftover bread and leftovers. Every time we have leftover bread and leftover sauces. But... Regardless, the joke is my caniac, my my canes order is high. 
Hi, hi. What, what do they say? Thanks for changing lanes and picking canes. I'm like, shut up. I'm here for business. I'll take the Caniac combo. Can I replace the slaw with extra fries? <laughs> can I get a large Coke Zero? And then in the extras category, can I get six pieces of toast and 15 cane sauces? Can I tell you something? Without fail, I'll film it next time just to prove it to you. Without fail, they always go, what? After the 15 sauces. Without fail. And I go, do you guys really want me to repeat? <laughs> like, this is so embarrassing for me. Without fail, they go, what? So that's that. That's uh, that's the Canes order. We don't need to talk about that one. The Tesla giveaway. So it's just to talk about. Um, uh, we, we, we've we fallen off with Captain this. And yapping. <laughs> hey, Wubby, long time chatter. I see something in the top section called Rap Cod. I'm not too familiar with that one. Do you mind showing us a video for reference? Thanks. Also, why isn't Wubicado on this list? <sighs> anyway. Uh... Tesla giveaway, we would do a marbles race where I pick one lucky viewer. I'm beginning uh, to feel like I hate cod, hate cod. All, right. all the people run around with their dog. <clears throat> all right. So anyway, I'm going to pause these because you guys can't help yourself. Do you want to know about the Tesla giveaway? We're trying to give away a Tesla to someone in chat, and I pick somebody randomly. If they win the race, uh, they get a Tesla. Nobody has ever won. Nobody's ever gotten close. Uh, and, you know, statistically, it'll never happen, but that's a Tesla giveaway. Rap cod. <sighs> I hate this one, not because I'm like particularly uh, embarrassed, but because I, f I genuinely feel like you guys have taken away my ability to uh, let my content speak for itself whenever a new person is introduced to me. Uh, because if I raid someone, if I talk to someone, if I interact in any way with somebody, you guys will go, hey, d have you guys seen that Wubby used to be a rapper? Uh, I'm going to show there. this. I'm going to show this very briefly. Um, but yes, me and Drumsy, who was on the Cash and Gun stream, made music together, you know, a little while ago. And you guys all know it. And one of the songs we made was called Rap Cod. It's terrible. I was very young. I was very bad. I did not. I was not proud of this. This was terrible. This was at the time, too, where uh, a lot. This was more common on YouTube. Let's say that. Uh, I did not consider myself a rapper, and chat will not let this go. So here is my verse of uh, of rap cod, or some of it. Okay, you can go look it up if you want. I'm beginning to feel like I hate cod, hate cod. All the people run around with their dog, their dog. Now who thinks that this game is gonna be long gone, long gone? They say it's something new, but it's the same cod, same cod. But they're still trying to get me to buy the game. We gotta bust the flies, we gotta soldier slide. I shouldn't have bought, but I complied. Vision sitting poolside and making millions of dollars off it, making everyone pump for Mars rockets, but it takes nine hours to unlock it. Damn it. I'm a fanboy just as on this, but these motherfucking maps are big as on Hello Kill. This part that I'm about to say, my when I put the voice effect on, I just want to fold myself out of existence. Right here. You're about to see it. It's all big as on Hello Kill Kill Killer Hall. Kill them all with the stupidity hippity damn dog, you really wanna get stuck. God God Alright, so Yes, you can all go watch it if you want. That is Rap Cod. I do not need to linger on that at all. All right, we are now into tier two, I believe. We are now going into the tier tier two of the of the of. Okay, I think we're still in a category where I don't need to waste too much time, but I will still give answers to all of these. The Sim Stream. Uh, that was a stream where the Sim Stream is what we refer to. See, in order to avoid DMCA issues, wink, wink, by the way, I'm not, this is all joke, I'm making all this up, we just play The Sims. But in a different universe, jokingly, when we would watch the show 90 Day Fiance before the 90 days, in order to watch it without getting any sort of uh, uh, eyes on us, any sort of attention, I would title it, uh, I would title it uh, uh, Sim Streams, we would be playing The Sims, because The Sims is a game about people moving and doing things, and so we would just all kind of call it The Sim Stream. Uh, when is the next session? I think the new season is in October. So we'll definitely be doing uh, Sim streams again. And then people started getting really creative with it. They made Sims overlays to go around the show as we watched it. It worked. We never got in trouble and we watched the whole... Just kidding, by the way. We never watched any TV. We just played Sims. But uh, And some of the deepest, funniest, best memes have come out of that show. I know it's lazy content, but goddammit. 
I will always prefer watching that show on stream than anywhere else. That's all I'm going to say. I do believe that this chat and my commentary combined make that show better than watching it alone on your couch. Thank you. Where is Poppy? There you go. All right, Wubby's dad. I mean, what can, what, what can you say about my dad? There's so much to say. Uh, let's see if there's any, like, specific clip here that we got. Wubby's, no, just tell a story. Oh, so, I mean, yeah, I mean, my dad. You guys have seen my dad. I started bringing him on streams more and more. My dad is a man of many faces, including he loves fish. You'll probably hear my dad give fish facts throughout this stream. Um, let's see if he's done that. Nope. Okay, I'm going to play him now. Uh, he loves fish. He loves holding out his hand for birds. He's Middle Eastern. What more do you want? That's my dad in a nutshell, okay? My dad has been involved more and more, and I love him. And I'm going to keep him safe from you guys because so far my dad believes that this stream is two things. A lot of money and really, really nice people who love me. And I want him to think that forever because I don't want him to know how absolutely fucked up the internet could be. So we're going to keep him at arm's length of this stream, all right? Okay, next is a handbag, and I'm going to give the only explanation I've ever been given for what this means to my stream. You ready? A handbag. All right, so that's that. If you want more of an explanation, well, then look for it yourself, because God, I don't know. Uh, all right, next we have the NF turd. Uh, we, I think we have a video here. I'll explain after seeing what this video offers. <clears throat> There's a lot of lore for the NF turd. All right, what do we and got here? We ended up selling uh, a video of the poo in my toilet for $20,000. So NFTs were popular and I thought they were very stupid. And I thought the funniest thing you could, I still think NFTs are absolutely ridiculous. The funniest thing and best way to capitalize on this is make an NFT of my poop stained toilet. So I took a video of it, loaded it up, made it an NFT and we made a launch party for it. We had a fake bid of $100,000 that caused all this drama. It was a whole thing. Ultimately, somebody did buy it for $20,000. All of that money I eventually wasted gambling on this stream in front of you guys. So there it is, um, the NF turd stream. That man still owns that video for $20,000. Shouts out to the price of ETH. Uh, that has not been good to him, I would imagine. So anyway, zoom in, please. Okay, jeez, you fucking... I didn't want to cover with the chat, you fucking losers. Um... And then, wait, uh, then a guy got angry for you selling it. People get very mad at NFTs, uh, and they don't really know how to even rationalize it. They're just mad. Uh, I do think that NF there's a lot of scams, a lot of crypto scams, yada, yada. I did not scam anybody. Uh, a crypto dude bought a video of my poo, and the video of my poo did not, poo did not come with fake promises. It did not come with some way he's going to make money. It did not come with anything other than, hey, I'm selling a photo of my poo. Would you like to buy it? And some rich crypto guy went, all right. <clears throat> Bro, NFTs are the worst. I'm proud to say that I, I do not have any sort of investments in NFTs um, at the time, uh, you know, when they were first booming, maybe I was interested, but I have really no interest in them at all. And I don't invest any money into them at all. Uh, and I would recommend all of you guys doing the same. All right. You sold Facebook. I love this one. And I'm so happy we get to talk about it. Uh, on a stream, I don't know what stream, just some random stream. I had just seen, or, or at the very least, it was on my mind, the movie called The Social Network with Mark Zuckerberg and Spider-Man. And uh, in that movie, there's a really powerful scene at the end of the movie where Spider-Man goes up to Mark Zuckerberg and he's like, you sold Facebook? Anyway, I love that scene. So I was trying to do it from memory on stream. And uh, people loved it. Okay, I loved it. And eventually it got tossed around. Why don't we remake that scene? Because it became a meme in this chat. I think it became a meme mostly because I misquoted it so heavily. Anyway, long story short, me and the boys decided to recreate the scene shot for shot. And God damn it, I think we did a really good job. I think we did a really good Could we do better? Sure, but... This was a stoop this was a stupid dead stream meme that we just did for fun one night. So here we go. Here's that I scene. found the monk from the 24 hour stream on my FIP and I mentioned that I recognized him from your stream in his chat and he immediately muted me from his live. Whoa, what? What? What happened to being like not earthly possessions or something? That sounds pretty bitter. Bitter sounds pretty human, you fucking 
weird Caillou looking dome idiot. What do you mean? Wait, he dude, someone just said dude same. What? What? He said, here's your vow of silence. He probably gets endless Wubby spam. You know what? I take it all back. Why were you spamming him, you fucking dip? You know what, Kai, I'm cool with the monk now. Monk, I take it all back. I apologize for what I just said. Why are you spamming this guy? Let him live. <laughs> I take it all back, monk. I legitimately, I'm sorry. What the f idiots? Leave him alone. That's super fair. God, I'm so quick to jump ship. Peanut pointed out, this video has 261,000 views. This was not uploaded by me. Somebody just up uploaded this, which I don't know how this got so many views. It's kind of funny, um, but here it is, okay. And also, I really want to remake more scenes. I know we talk about it. We talk about it a lot, but here we go. Mr. Sab. Mark? 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 He's, He's wired, wired in. in. Sorry? He's wired He's in. Is he? Yes. Is he? What about now? You still wired in? It's called security. You issued over 24, 24 million, million new shares of stock. stock. We added this in. This was not a line, but we decided to add this in for the meme. You sold Facebook. You were told, you were that, told that if new investors... How much were your shares diluted? How much, much were his? his? You, signed you signed the papers. papers. You set me up? You're going to blame, blame me, me because you're because the business... You anyway, you can watch the whole thing if you want. It's so good. It's so... Everyone did so well. I'm so proud of everyone. It's so good. Uh, play it. All right. Head of a company, of a company and you made, and you made a bad, bad business, business deal, deal with, with your, your own company? It's going to be like I'm not a part of Facebook. It won't be like... Like you're not a part of Facebook? You're not a part of Facebook. You're not a part of Facebook. My name's on the masthead. You might want to check again. Is it because I froze the account? Think you really think we're going to let you parade around, around in those suits, ridiculous suits pretending, pretending like you were running this company? Sorry! I brought us at the cleaners! Along with oh, my oh, hoodie oh, and oh, fuck oh, you, oh, you oh, 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 pretentious douchebag! Douchebag! Security's here. You'll be leaving now? I'm not signing those papers. We will get the signature. Tell me this isn't about me getting with the Phoenix. You didn't! You planted that story about the chicken! Listen for the accent on Spider-Man. You did it! I know you, you did it! You, did. you, you planted, planted that, story that story about the about chicken. chicken! I didn't plant the story about the chicken. What's he talking about? You had me accused of animal cruelty! Seriously, what the hell's the chicken? And I'll bet that you hated the most is that they identified me as a co-founder of Facebook, which I am. You better lawyer be up your asshole, because I'm not coming back. I don't care. Let this be rap card then. I'm coming I'll back for everything. For everything. All right, there you go. There you go. All right, there's more, but whatever. You get the point. We have so much to get through. Anyway, boom, boom, boom. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Uh, that's you. So, Masked Menace. Yes, another good one. So, uh, I threw a Christmas party for some friends. And at this Christmas party, uh, Peanut received in a white elephant a... Um, actually, I don't know if it was Peanut. I don't actually know who it was. Never mind. I'm changing the story live. Uh... Somebody showed up in a uh, baklava, balaclava, and was terrorizing the party. We don't know who it is. Uh, and since then, this person has made a few appearances on different streams. And it, he's kind of unstoppable. But here is the mass menace. Let me show you this. Hold on. I can't show the real song, but here he is at the party. Just be, look at this. He showed up. He started eating all the food. Delinquent, bro. He or she. I, I guess. Look at him. Absolute delinquent. Look at this. Not a care in the world. Look at Tex. So happy. God, he's making a mess. The food. Who is he? We don't know, but this is the mass menace. There's our boy TT. TT getting really schmoozy with this guy. Like, we don't even know who this guy is, bro. It's a masterpiece, isn't it? Who did he sleep with that night? Everyone. No. True, true. So that's the mass menace. There you go. Um, Benny Hanna. All right, so this one's really simple. It's just a little story. Um, at the end of a production, it became a joke just through it happening over and over. Someone will always say, hey, Benny Hanna after this? Uh, or, and now it's kind of evolved to like the show will start and it, shows always start off rocky. People kind of get in the groove. Five minutes into every show, I go, you guys just want to say fuck this and go to Benny Hanna? I think it, it came down to Benny Hanna can seat 10 people quickly. I think that's why we kind of started going there. And now it's just, it's an absolute meme. Hey, Benny Hanna after this. We don't actually go to Benny Hanna that much. Like, at least now we don't. Uh, Benny Hanna, this guy is so wants me to hear this. Benny Hanna owned by Steve Aoki's dad. Benny, H we know, bro, we know. We know. We know, it's okay. 
Uh, okay, you're not safe here. Is there any? Is there any video for this? There is. Oh shit! I know what this is from. I just don't know. What th is this the? First? No way. This is the first. You're not safe here. Let's watch this clip. Is this it? What? Oh, this is it. Is it? This is the first one. Who's there? Is that your intimidating voice? You're not safe here. <laughs> so Alex and I were doing high laugh you lose and we heard a noise so I did the man thing that a man does and I went out gun ready and I was intimidating the potential break in there wasn't actually anyone breaking in we got very lucky we dodged a bullet but uh, uh, I wanted to let the robber know that he's not safe here and and I shoot to maim you know and it worked the score holy fuck <laughs> They're she saying this it. is an elaborate far quad. God. What? Chad! Who's been paying attention? Who's been paying attention, Chad? Ah, uh, huh, 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 huh. See, you gotta keep up. All right, Kenroy. What do we have on Kenroy? Like, I, I can describe it, I just don't know what we have on him. Oh, we got something on Kenroy. We got, we got something on Kenroy. Is this the first sighting of Kenroy? This is the 24 hour stream. I know what happens. Kenroy in bed, but. To Kenroy. Okay, I'm gonna try to say hi to Kenroy real quick and then I'll be back. Salute. He's in. Dude, <laughs> unfucking believable. <laughs> so, I did a 24 hour stream. And in that 24 hour stream, there was one guy alone in a room with his camera on the whole time. That man, that goat, we know today as Kenroy, Uncle Kenroy, whatever you want to call him. He is, he, I, I, I don't know what his, still to this day, as I've grown to, I've grown to understand Kenroy a little bit better. I still don't understand what he was doing. <laughs> and that we would check in on him and he would just be sitting there barely awake, alone in a bed in this full Japanese garb. He fucking made it. Kenroy. Is he, he's sipping out of a pitcher, bro. <laughs> a new combo. <laughs> Drinking out and of a, a fucking angle. pitcher. God, I'm the same man. He kept me going. Same, Alex. He kept me going too. So there's Kenroy. We love Kenroy. The cans. Oh boy. Is there a video for this one? I can. I can also describe this one. No, there's no video. All right. So, uh, my YouTube channel, my old YouTube, and uh, even just in general, uh, for old time's sake, I'll do it. But I would always put my cans on in my old YouTube videos. Call these bad boys the cans right here. And I would always do it in a funny way for my YouTube. So here it is. Okay, you ready? So I do a little intro. Hey guys, Wubby, woo! And then I'm like, let's get the cans on. And then you do one of these. Ah. Uh. There you go. And I would always edit it and whatever. Oh, you want the echo? You want the echo? I got you. I got you. Ah. Uh. So there's that. That's the cans. That's what when people say the cans, that's what they mean. Uh, Robert E.T. That was actually donated on the last media share. It's just a YouTube video about uh, from from Robert E. Lee that's been changed to Robert E.T. It's down. I'm not going to pull it up. Booby. Booby. Play it. You guys want me to play it? I, we just, the thing is, we just saw it on media share. That was three days ago. I can show it. Fine. I'll show it. I'll show it. We have it in here. We have it in the dock. Just play it. I'll play it. I'll play it. I'll play it. I, I'm just trying to make time for the things that I know people don't know. Um, and this one was literally just played, but whatever. We'll get to the part with his weird neck, and then we'll call it there. This is Robert E.T. This has just been donated to MediaShare a bunch of times. Can anyone say they know the general? Can anybody say they know the general? I doubt it. I doubt it. He looks so cold, quiet. Show me the and photo. Grand. Show me the photo. Robert E.T. is uh, one of the most difficult to. Helton Shelter, thank you for the five. I think that meme ultimately ended up uh, being put to rest when somebody paid for the guy who made Wubby, the video. Please stop. You're stealing my memories and giving them to new frogs. I need those for validation. Please stop. <laughs> you're, you're, you're being validated now. Uh, it was a Discord meme originally. It's been a lot. It's been a lot. I mean, a lot of whispers for the fried chicken song. TT, what could that possibly mean? 
What could that I, Okay, he said play this. Outer ass eating fried chicken at your mom's yeah. ass. Fried chicken, gotta eat my fried chicken, gotta eat that is an old okay do you guys get that reference holy shit who gets that reference who gets that reference barely that was a song that artist i would use for the intro for a lot of my ancient videos my very old videos i use that guy as my intro for a lot of them damn okay um booby booby the barber i don't think Many of you will know this one. I got a haircut on stream before the last, uh, the first streamer awards, I think it was. I got a haircut on stream by a uh, person who comes to your house, who will actually cut your hair in your house. That's and his $5, name, $5, oh God, we're watching Adopt Nails. And his name was uh, Booby the Barber. And he became quite a little stream, uh, a little character on stream. We love Booby the Barber. Cinquante Dick Snuff. In fact, I got my haircut by him. Um, more recently at his shop and he's he's just a nice guy i love him yeah and then i started <laughs> you go get this man a soul patch also check out his music the soul patch i'm beginning guys you know it's like poetry you know it's like it's fun fish fact you can't escape your past the truth will come out love you son it, 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 thank you it's like it, it, it's like poetry it's like poetry it just rhymes doesn't it to feel like a hate car, hate car. Okay, well, man, he was so nice about it too. You know, was there cat poop under that tree at the time? Pro probably. There probably was. All right. Uh, that's booby. Dear Reddit. Uh, dear Reddit. Let's see if I even screenshot something. Basically, dear Reddit is a meme. Oh, I did. I pulled up Reddit for this. Um, I guess it doesn't matter. If you search on my subreddit right now, Dear Reddit, you will see a bunch of posts making fun of Dear Reddit. Dear Reddit is in reference to after anything going wrong on stream, you'll see, or anything going right on stream, it doesn't even fucking matter. People going to bitch. Wait, what's F? Why is everyone saying F? Why is everyone saying F? What's F? What's F? Why is everyone saying F? Why is everyone saying F? Hello? What, what's happening? Un, you're still up? Troll? Why were so many people saying it then? <laughs> it's all good. All right. You guys realize I have to look, I, ha I have to acknowledge the Fs when they happen. It went down for like a second. Okay, okay, whatever. Um, what was I talking about then? Where were we? Uh, where were we? Oh, dear Reddit. Basically, dear Reddit, uh, it starts from people going to the subreddit to complain and bitch about things that, uh, that happen on stream and then eventually it's now become a meme where people are dear redditing making fun of people complaining about stream and what's happened on stream so if you look up dear Reddit right now it's mostly ironic posts ironically bitching about something that happened on stream it's a deep lore who cares whatever uh chat our locus amen brother all right, desk butter, desk butter. Uh, it got revealed at one point. I don't think we have the clip of it, but I can still describe it. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, it got revealed at one point that I keep butter on my desk in case of a butter emergency. Uh, I think everybody should have a desk butter. You never know when you might be eating something that requires some buttering. Uh, and uh, yeah, I keep butter on my desk Fun for a desk fish emergency. Fact, you can put a nice big base between some slices of mystic bread. Thank you. Um, so that's desk butter. I have desk makeable syrup. You fucking, that's creepy and weird and scary. Nothing requires buttering. You're not eating enough corn at your desk or maybe some toast. Hmm. I have desk weed. Okay. Anyway, uh, show it. I no longer have desk butter. We used it all. And then I was told to stop doing it. Uh, Jigglypuff. Uh, the argument of how many syllables does the word Jigglypuff have, which really, I think that's what this is which tore the community apart and we had to just, we, we never got to a solution. We just had to stop talking about it. Jig, Lee, Puff, everybody. Jig, Lee, Puff, big spaces in between them. Jig, Lee, Puff, everybody. Jig, Lee, Puff, ready? All at once, Jiggly Puff, Jiggly Puff. This it's, th it's three syllables. So let's do, let's, we're gonna do this together, chat. We're gonna, I'm gonna do this one last time for old time's sake, ready? 
Okay. The word jiggly. Jiggly. Two syllables. Puff. 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 One syllable. Combine it. Jiggly puff. That's two plus one. Here we go. This is big. This is the big jump for chat. Two plus one, three. Jiggly puff. Okay. You guys add an ah uh, because in the show she sings jiggly puff, jiggly puff. Is she nine syllables? No, idiot. Jiggly puff. Okay. We're not doing this again. The stream is now over. Yeah, I know, right? We're not doing this again. We're not doing this again. All right. Uh, oh, Jew. This is a good one. I have what I think might be the origin of this. So when I get startled, scared, alarmed, I will often say, ah, oh, Jew. Uh, and here is, uh, here is that. <clears throat> God damn it. Oh, God damn. Can I say Jews on Twitch? I'm so there you go. <clears throat> and uh, it turns out I could. So uh, as far as like actually understanding what that comes from, I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I, I It's just me. You suck. I think that was just. Leap. Leap. You suck. You suck. That sound alert that somebody just played uh, was a one of the first sound alerts I ever put on stream. And it was put on stream because I was really bad at video games. And I wanted people to be able to tell me I suck while I make money. So the you suck. You suck. Uh, there it is. It started from there. All right. The boob apocalypse or the tit apocalypse uh, was I, by the way, I, I don't know if I ever made this clear, but I'm gonna make it so clear now. You I suck. Okay. <coughs> <coughs> I jokingly, jokingly mentioned that I would be nuking uh, the subreddit after uh, people on the subreddit were pissing me off with how stupid they are. That kind of ties into dear Reddit. This was very recently. I jokingly said that and somebody posted their tits on the subreddit uh and then i think i don't know if i brought it up on stream or not but whatever and then over the next 48 hours uh it turned with no encouragement at all with i wasn't even live the entire sub i mean every post was just girls posting their titties being like wubby don't delete the subreddit here's some tits for everyone uh it was absurd. I honestly felt like I needed to, the next stream that I came back to. I think it was Wednesday or whenever it was. I was like, hey, ladies, I need my voice to be heard. Stop. Uh, now, Dad, fun fish fact. It's four syllables. Okay, cool, cool, Dad. Now, that being said, now that being said, we had to go through the rules and explain, yes, titties are allowed, but I don't want people thinking that I was not going to delete the subreddit because of their titties. That feels weird. So, no, that wasn't the case. But either way, it led to, honestly, one of the funniest, most hey, ridiculous. Why is step 73 not on this iceberg? Step... I was late to one iceberg stream, and now I'm already behind on memes. Oh, step 73, because that just happened today, brother. Anyway, uh, it, 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 yeah, so that's, uh, I, I honestly, the Boopocalypse was fucking hilarious. I think at the end of the day, it was funny, uh, and it was great. All right, uh, Burger Planet. <sighs> Wubby looks like Burger Planet. Burger Planet uh, is another YouTuber, streamer, whatever you want to call him. And he ran into Extra Emily, a live streamer who I'm now homies with, on her stream very recently. We're going to take a look at that. Live streaming too? I am! What are you? you hey, oh. how are, what's your name? Extra Emily? I'm Burger Planet. Nice to nice meet you. Nice to meet you. You too. Guys, are you just, streaming you on Twitch? Up? Yeah, I'm on Twitch Hello. too. Okay, so she has an interaction with him. He is very cringe and makes her uncomfortable. Oh. Origins. I tried to Emily sell it Hyde. to someone for ten dollars, oh, but Emily so far no takers. Oh, that's okay. The corners broke, but oh. the get the uh, the disc is in very high. Well, the disc fell on the ground, but it's still probably pretty good. Nice. Yeah, dang it. Thank you. Right. I hope you have a good day. Oh, I'm having a good day. Thank you. Have a good day. Well, nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Bye bye. I was pay money. Wait, what? what? Is he banned? I learned that that was Pay Money Wubby, and I'm like, is Pay Money Wubby in New York City? I will not get mad at that clip again, because we promised we wouldn't, but uh, uh, that's what started the 
really unfair, rude, awful, hurtful comparison that I look like Burger Planet. And since then, there's been a bunch of clips that have gone of me and Emily going back and forth. We met up at uh, Streamer Awards, and I actually really like her. And uh, it is what it is. So hopefully we can collab at some point. Nice smile. Nice smile I actually love. We're going to work the left side of the iceberg right now. Nice smile is a meme on the subreddit that I noticed. And then now it's because I brought it up on stream, it's become an extreme meme. Basically, it does not matter what the girl is doing. If a woman posts anything that identifies her as a woman on the subreddit, it does not matter if her face isn't in it. It could be her tits and not her face. It could be her hand and not her face. She could be showing off her gamer subs and not her face. If people have identified her as a woman, the comments will always be nice smile. I think it came up or it came to be because I noticed there were some cringe dudes in the subreddit who a girl would post her titties or her body or whatever she's posting, right? Or even just fully clothed and she'd be smiling. And these dudes would do like the, uh, like the most nice guy thing ever, right? Totally naked girl in front and you go, oh, I love your smile. It's like, okay, bro. Okay. So I thought that was funny. Long story short, uh, uh, it became a thing and now every time a woman posts anything um we say nice smile so nice smile indeed uh he's got tits love this one this one's good hey wubby did the old worm donation video make the list the old worm donation video oh no it didn't it didn't it didn't i want to be clear by the way uh you guys are a hive mind of thousands of people and uh, Booty put this together, all, like, mostly alone with the help of that other dude's iceberg and some mods. So it's a lot easier to be like, what about this one? What about that one? What about this one? So I'm sorry. We don't have everything. But, yeah. Uh, here is the He's Got Tits clip. Why am I? I just heard my doorbell ring. You're not safe here. Not sure if this is on the iceberg, but Super Seducer should be mentioned. I love that shit also. You look hotter now compared to old Wubby. Fuck I you. I shoot to me! Hold on a second, guys. Anyway, <clears throat> here is the clip of He's Got Tits. I was on the show Hive Mind. Also, shouts out to Susu. How about I'm that just, boy stuck in time on the list? I, 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 uh, I'm using her upload. I don't know why this was the first one that popped up, but uh, she's a homie too, so shouts out to her. Um, I was on Hive Mind, which I won, by the way. You know what? I'll give you real deep lore here. You want deep iceberg? We're going to go to the eighth layer right now, and I'll give you a real one. Twitch originally reached out to me to host this shit, and then they ghosted me. Actually, I shouldn't get too much into this. And then guess what, bitch? I came back and won the whole thing. You can't get rid of me. All right, here we go. So this is me on the show with Anita, and she says this. Wubby, what do you got for your number two? He's got tits. That hurts. <laughs> that was me. Um, I got, uh, I'm going to go with Cool Noodle. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, ah, oh, that hurts. Uh, no, but she's great. Uh, love Anita. And that was, that was funny anyway, and I love the meme that came out of it. All right. I know it's an older meme, but I hope knowing how to check your horse for horse pneumonia is on the list. That's a deep cut. I don't know if it is, but if it isn't, I'll, I'll make sure to talk about it. Um, show microwave. <clears throat> In my very old videos, uh, I would uh, abuse my microwave. This is very old videos. I'm talking a thousand views videos. Uh, I would show my microwave and I would abuse it. Uh, that turned into a stream meme where whenever we would raid somebody, and when I say raid, I'm talking very few viewers. We would go and we would demand them showing uh, their microwave. That then carried throughout the years and eventually I stopped raiding people, but showing your microwave became a thing. Uh, and I'm gonna show you guys a great, one of my favorites from it. And also this was easy to find. It's part of the reason I picked it, but one of my favorites, uh, my good, good, good friend, nice shot Hugo, uh, actually chucked his microwave right. off Three, his balcony. Two, one. Yeet. Oh, shit. And that was for us. That was for our community. And that was because uh, after a raid, I think somebody donated to him and he yeeted it and he got in trouble for it. So shouts out to nice shot Hugo for that. Um, Wendy. We already saw Wendy earlier. Wendy was our uh, uh, lie detector uh, person. We love Wendy, our, our resident Edna mode. Uh, she is definitely not that John loser. This is She's her. She's here. 
Oh, she's here. Yes, she is. Star. It is invasive. This is Wendy. Dude, I look like one of those tits. hams hanging. From uh, am I blind? <laughs> uh, or is Australia nowhere on the iceberg? Like those dope ass kangaroos never even existed. Bro, your favorite streamer is so funny. Holy shit, dude. Ugh. Nothing cracking me up more than from me. A, from a butcher hook that's all wrapped <laughs> up in cloth. <laughs> <laughs> um, from Sir. Yeah, Wendy's great. Watch these vods; they're on YouTube. Just go watch them. That, and it, it's on Horse Kim Kardashian. Is Horse Kim Kardashian on here? There it is. Fuck. All right, this has been my favorite section. So it was way better than the first section. Uh, hey O'Connell. Hey O'Connell. <laughs> God, I snapped right back into it, huh? Hey O'Connell. Looks like we have all the horses. Hey, buddy. So, as you guys know, I'm a huge... Maybe you don't know. That's why you're here, right? I'm a huge fan of the movie The Mummy and The Mummy Returns. Brendan Fraser could get it. Evie could get it. That boy could not get it. Benny could get it. Um, and for whatever reason, this one scene... How did I father suck a fuckable ginger? Like, goddamn, you got me beating my meat. Thank you, Dad. Uh... I would always quote that scene that I just quoted from The Mummy, and then, who was this? Uh, Walsh? Uh, someone, and then somebody edited uh, the scene with me over it, so here is this. Hey, O'Connell! Looks like we have all the horses! <laughs> Looks to me like you're on the wrong side of the river! Shit. Wait, that's Daniel Day-Lewis's fake brother, bro! Um, okay, so if you guys haven't, by the way, st strong recommendation. Go watch The Mummy tonight. The Mummy is just such a fun turn-off-your-brain movie. Love it. It's fun. It's action. Primo content. Go watch it. That's from The Mummy. Arabian Nights 9.5. Uh, I think this is in reference to the fact that I collect... Uh, I mean, me and Booty were figuring out what this was in reference to. I believe this is in reference Dear to the Reddit fact that... was the parody of Dear Stan that you did... I don't think that's how it started, but maybe, maybe, maybe you could be right. Um, uh, Arabian Nights 9.5. Arabian Nights is a set in Magic the Gathering. I love Magic the Gathering. It's an old vintage set. Uh, I collect Arabian Nights graded 9.5, and I uh, I have a, I, I don't know. I, I don't know exactly what the what is here, but I have the, I have, show, show retard card. It's packed away, brother. Not how it started, but that's definitely how it ended. All right. Moving on to the next one. Uh, Julie Pup. Oh, Jude, you suck. We did that. Stan parody. All right. So I don't remember the exact reason why I did this, but I can give a general reason. I canceled stream because I was sick. Something happened. It may have been sick. It may have been busy. Whatever it was, I canceled stream and I gave a reason. And the subreddit lit up. It was like I almost retired. It. They were so... Like, it was... It was because, hold on, someone has a reason. It was because you canceled stream. Yeah, but what was the reason for the cancellation? It just, none of it mattered, right? Instead of, you know, people being like, ah, I'm annoyed, I don't get to watch stream, moving on. People took it to this level on the subreddit, and this is, I think, the last time it was ever that bad, because I think people realized it's not, to we don't tolerate it, right? You just leave the community if you're that mad. Um, but Reddit went, cra like, it was crazy. They were so... Uh, uh, it was the friend discord explosion. That's different. Um, anyway, still waiting uh, one of your on the friends music something? video. That's something different though. The Stan, we're talking about Stan. Your mom had cancer scare. Is that what it was? I think it was. That actually sounds maybe more right. Uh, that's why you canceled. All right, whatever. The re long story short, uh, the subreddit went absolutely feral. They went way too far. And things started getting personal and weird and like Paris, people were weaponizing everything they could against me. And so I made a return to stream with a fully written song. Ham wrote a verse, chat wrote, or someone on the subreddit wrote a verse and I wrote the third verse. I performed it all, edited it all, and we opened stream with it. It is very cringe, but it did kind of shut everything down. Um, Yeah, but I mean, here, you can watch it, whatever you want to watch. I even watched the underground shit. It's a whole, it's the whole thing. It's the whole, it's the whole, it's the whole thing. It, I'm not going to play the whole thing. Sorry, yes, it's on I YouTube. Hope you hear it. It's the whole thing. Anyway, there you go. Uh, play some. No, it's very cringe. It's very embarrassing, but there it is. I, sorry. Nope. You get the information. You can do with it what you want.
All right, there you go. Cool. Hype train. I am a pussy. Hi, Dennis. Just popping by to say I'm Hi, incredibly Dad. attracted to Wendy and her weird Lego hair. <laughs> <laughs> Fun fish fact. I wove my whittle stooshy wussy ussy boy. Ooh. And I'm not seeing tub A on the list yet. You said you'd never forget. All right, so the Wubby Hype Train, I think, is in reference to the Wubby Subtrain. Uh, we've had Subtrain videos where basically uh, I play them and people give subs. The most recent one is kind of the one we've been stuck on for over a year. It's very, very well done. I don't like playing it typically, but basically if a lot of subs come in, people eventually go, play the train video, play the train video, get the train hype going. And I'll be like, I don't want to. It seems like bait. And they'll go, come on, do it. It's all fake. I'm, of course I'm going to play it. And then we play it, people give subs and go crazy. Here is the current one we're working off of. If someone wants to make a better one than this, not that this one isn't good. In fact, don't waste your time if you can't do something better than this. This one is kind of incredible. I don't know if anyone could beat it. Um, but here is, I'm not going to play the whole thing, um, but here is some Fart. of the Wubby train, sub train video. Come on, motherfuckers, come on. Come on, motherfuckers, come on. Yeah. Come on, motherfuckers, come on. thank you for the five. Come on, motherfuckers, come on. I mean, look at it look at it for all the memes it has i don't when it plays i don't normally you guys are really gonna give subs during this this is so i mean i appreciate it okay to those just watching for the lore actually watch the video and look at all the references that are in this it's crazy okay got coconut mauled share this with all your friends to totally coconut maul them i do want to see fat wubby though we'll skip to that fat wubby's crazy here look at this the kid dude can you guys hear that on the mic the yeah. yeah all right there it is boys the uh train video when you guys really gifted subs during that like like a mall still waiting on the, the kda music video Thank you for the KDA music video. That's true. Uh, some of you guys just really, really... I told you we would do... I told you I'd make good on all those promises before retirement. All right. Bexasaurus, thank you for the five. Uh, Misano, thank you for the 25. Jesus Christ, Meat Man. Panda King, the collective known as Amico. Thank you. Uh, Brother DJ, thank you. Dipstick Slim. Uh, Slayer Magni. Garbagoobagool. Thumpert, Stony Berry. Uh, Salty the Caesar, thank you again for the 20. TXP Sigma, thank you. 1024, thank you. Wait, ten, if you guys don't know, the voice of, or maybe I don't know, whatever. The voice of Didn't Ask, I believe that's 1024. If you guys don't know, someone in chat, the Didn't Ask, is that his voice? I can't even remember what it sounds like. Um, uh, Boy Wonder, Magnacore, Soladolo, thank you. Wacky, thank you for the 10. Not 1052, is that on here? Is 1052 on here? Is 1052 on here? I think it is. Yes, it is. Okay, we'll talk about that then. JD Des, thank you. Bayaloom, thank you. Sturmy, Quiet, Wyatt. I told you guys about how Wyatt uh, 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 diddled me in um, at, at church, uh, at youth group. Uh, Heavy Whip, thank you for the 10. Engineer Jesse, thank you. Proctor, thank you for the 10. Pro oh, Proctor. Proctor, do you think he could be beat? Uh, Q Pyrus, thank you. Crimson, new type. Everyone's racer, gravy bomb, Bion Hage, thank you for the 10. Branaso, Branaso, thank you for the five. The, the rooster, the, oh, Br Branaso, that's our boy. The rooster, thank you. Gasha, beep bop, grip harder, ladies. Obi Wan Kenobi, thank you. Oh my god, there's so many. Oh my god, Red Menace, Magnus, Joy Boy, Mr. Gare Bear, Glasses McDork face. Some code monkey, thank you. I dream of you every night. Please make it stop. 
That's on you, dog. All right, where are we? Where were we? Where are we? Uh, Stan Parody hype train. Cool Wubby. Uh, do we have a origin? I don't know if Press A is on here, but when Wubby and Alex would play a co-op game and Alex would be confused or when he wanted her to finish her turn, Wubby would just say Press A, which so just we turned into true. chat spamming Press A. True. True. Thank you for filling in the whole thing. Aesthetically geeky, thank you for the five. Uh, cool, Wubby, we do not have a full origin for, but this is something that I think planted the seed. I feel like something's going to jump out at me. That's the vibe I'm getting right now. It was just cute. Why did the quality just Thank drop you. so hard? What the hell is happening with this quality, dude? What's going on with this quality? There we go. Hey, son, I don't know if you noticed, but the hype train flying off into the sky can be seen on the latest bus background you have. What? We'll have to look at that in a second. I did not know that. That's really fucking cool. <laughs> yeah, fuck having sex. Yeah! What the fuck is that? What the fuck? Oh! So uh, that guy is is the cool wubby, as people deemed him. That is the cool wubby. Uh, I don't know the first time me cool wubby made an appearance. Oh, excuse me. This is how cool wubby talks. Actually, I don't know the first time cool wubby myself made an appearance on stream. But um, this is all the uh, information we have on me. I just showed up one day and I'll, I'm gay by the way if you guys did for your god I'm a gay man cool whoopie baby I'm gonna pass it back over to uh 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 uh, 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 uh wubby normal wubby I thought he had a prefix he does not <laughs> so yeah that's uh that's the, that's cool wubby origin I don't know the first time I put the glasses on if someone could find it or I mean sorry fuck uh all right, I think uh, Cool Wubby made his first appearance when you got a pair of sunglasses during a P.O. Box stream. Really? We're all thinking okay. about it. We can't get it out of our heads. We need the lore for the stream villain, Chev. The stream villain, Chev? Okay, well, hold on. Let me get through these. We'll get through these, and then you guys can ask any questions about ones I may have missed. All right. Horse Kim Kardashian. I love that this one exists this one, we have an ex not too many of these we have this for. This one we have an exact origin for. And I mean to the moment. Saved by Taco Boy. Shouts out to Taco Boy. Here it is. The exact, what is this, Peanut? What is this? What is this? All right, Alex, here's what I'm <clears throat> I might have to end. I don't know what's happening. I'm seriously Do you just have the hiccups? Oh, hold on. I'm getting a knock at the door. Oh, I think... Is this it? Is this the first time? Hold on. I think Cool Wubby's here. <laughs> Dad, I you it's Cool Wubby. Wow. Hey, yo. Today's her story. Well, there you go. Thank you, Peanut. Good job. Clutch. All right. Here we have Horse Kim Kardashian. The origins of Horse Kim Kardashian. You might be asking, Wubby, what is Horse Kim Kardashian? What is that in the stream? What does that mean? This video is the only information I have on what Horse Kim Kardashian is. Here we go. Hey, Paper Heart! Hey! 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 Retard! Why do you keep spamming Horse Kim Kardashian? Why? What is wrong with you? Why? You have been spamming this for 10 fucking minutes! What does it mean? I googled it! You know, I, I, hold on, I googled it, I'll show you. It just came up with pictures of fucking Kim Kardashian on a horse! Look, I'll sh I swear to God I googled it and I didn't even say anything, okay? There's so many things going on behind the scenes here, you fucking idiot! Look, 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 look! The music, look, dude. Look, this is the shit that came up! What? Who, who cares? <laughs> so what you guys don't know, and I did say it, but maybe I didn't explain it well. Without saying anything during that stream, while I was talking, I Googled it to see if something happened, some inside joke I didn't get, to see what, and I Googled it and nothing came up. So then I tried to let it go. I'm like, okay, crazy viewer, schizo viewer. I'm just going to ignore it right so then he kept 
spamming it. And that's when I lost my cool. And that's that clip. He's here in chat right now. Ask him. Get him on a call. Peanut, can you get this Paper Heart guy on a call right now? Paper Heart 87. Paper Heart, get on a call right now and explain horse Kim Kardashian. Check Discord DMs. I'll check right now. Get on a call right now. Um, yeah, I like the red inside. Yep, I'm ready, Alex. Do it. Send it. Do it. We're getting samples for merch, baby. Merch is moving. Merch is moving. A paper heart, get in the call. Let's do it. I want to know. We will get real history here in the making. All right, we'll move on for now, but Peanut, you know what to do. All right, best friend Hassan. I like this one. This one's wholesome. And we have, again, we have a perfect clip of hey, this as well. Wubby, this is your conscience speaking. Maybe we shouldn't advertise to chat that we are now best friends with the same person who did 9 11. <laughs> uh, true, 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 true. So I, I used Wubby, to have a I lot. I think you missed it, but aesthetically geeky, who just gifted five subs, is the live right now girl. I don't know if that's on the iceberg, but it's relevant. You know what's funny? You know what's funny about that? About that whole thing? I thanked the subs and I moved on. You know what that's like? That's like running into your bully outside of high school and you're shaking as you approach him. And he goes, I don't even know who you are. All right, so. <laughs> kidding, that is so mean and I'm totally joking. Hassan on September 2001. Thank you for the five. No, by the way, I'm, I'm, I don't, there's no, the, the he's live right now thing is funny. I guess it didn't make the cut. I would talk about it. I'm not trying to like erase history here. I don't care. Prosciutto is Italian uncooked, unsmoked, and dry cured We're going to get to prosciutto. Prosciutto crudo is usually served thinly sliced. Uh, Hassan on September 2001, we need to know where you were. Please admit it. But anyway, me and Hassan, you know, didn't always have see eye to eye. We beefed a little bit. I wouldn't even say beef. You know, I didn't like him very much. I don't think he liked me very much. We are now way past that. Years have gone by. But the moment that we became cool can actually be caught on stream. I open stream with this friendship ended with capitalism. Now Hassan is my best friend. And then Hassan reacted to it. And here is that clip. People are, bro. Hassan's new I, I've met Pay Money Wubby. I like him a lot more now. I think we had, like, you know, we had some turbulent uh, relationships in the beginning. But I think he's funny. He's a funny dude. I like him. Friendship ended with capitalism. Now Hassan is my best friend. <laughs> he's playing. He knew the fucking song, dude. He, did you hear him just... He started spitting, too. Listen to this. Listen to what he says here. What is he even saying? <laughs> Bro, what is that? <laughs> like, what? Just switching gears. Uh, anyway, that's the French best friend Hassan thing. Uh, it's... Uh, I thought it was a cute little moment, too. Uh, Mr. Teeth. Well, boys... Time to buckle up, strap in. Make sure your Hassan seatbelt is tight against your chest. Hassan reminds you of a cucumber. Why? Wow, you want to shove him in your ass? Uh, we're going to be here for a couple hours on this one because God knows I will look for any excuse to talk about this one. Uh, and I will, I, will, <laughs> I will not stop. In fact, once I get going, I can't be stopped. So, Saki, must take it for the five. So this is, uh, I'm going to pull this clip up now. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We have a clip from it. I won't, I won't get too into it. Okay, I won't, I won't drain you guys on this but let's see what this clip is and then if i have to accept what the fuck tts was only 500 god damn it tts was only 500 so i'll just very briefly exp explain it i noticed at some point while watching mr beast videos that his teeth changed and they didn't change in a way that made sense they started uh you know crooked and then they got like veneer level straight they got crazy veneer level straight and i was like that's odd and then they went back to like misshapen and crooked nothing bad about it i'm not criticizing him i just thought it was kind of interesting right biggest youtuber in the world he's gonna be open to being looked at like this right so then i went and i don't know what got me to this point because i think i was looking for i think i searched it on reddit and nobody had any for i'm like nobody's noticed this so then i went to his youtube and i left a comment that just said teeth and this is when teeth gate got blown open for me the word teeth to, as far as I'm aware, last I checked was less than a month ago. The word teeth is shadow banned on Mr. Beast's YouTube. The largest YouTuber in the world has the word teeth shadow banned on his YouTube. Now, granted, I'm, I, get, I saw some people being party poopers saying, bro, maybe he's just insecure about his teeth. Please stop. Okay, I get it. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. Or maybe... This is one of the largest conspiracies the world's ever seen. 
So I'm not going to get too into it. You can watch this VOD, Wubby Streams, Mr. Teeth, where I go in depth and I get mad. We even bring a dentist on. Every time I talk about this, we bring a dentist on. Um, but I think, I, I'll be honest, I, no matter what you say, insecurity or not, it definitely is an odd thing for the largest YouTuber on the planet to be concerned with, isn't it? No matter how, oh, he's insecure about his teeth. Bro is nearly a billionaire. It is definitely not something you expect of some, that's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Don't overthink it. It's just for fun. I don't care. I don't care. Also, people always ask me, what's my dream collab? I will always say, Mr. Beast, and I will corner him about the teeth. I am I'm on a Mac. Him, I guarantee it. I'm on a Mac? All right, Peanut's telling me to check Discord. I think we have we have Horse Kim Kardashian. <gasps> I am in a, oh my God, I am in a group chat with ho the Horse Kim Kardashian guy. This is actually big for me, I'm calling. Chat, I need you to listen. Mr. Beast has been kidnapped and needs our help. Grab your pool noodles, and we need to fight that Chris guy because he has kidnapped. Hello? Hello? Hi. Are you horse Kim Kardashian girl? <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, so, that's shocking. <laughs> Paper Heart, could you please tell us, once and for all, what is horse Kim Kardashian? Um, so just for the record, I was really high that stream, like really high. Uh -huh. And you were talking about Fallout Boy. Uh -huh. And the only reason it came up was because I was like, oh, Kim Kardashian's in it. And I said, she, her face looks like a horse. So I kept spamming <laughs> horse Kim Kardashian. See that you would see it. But I mean, you did. So. Sorry. So wait, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 don't be sorry. So let me, I just want to make sure we understand this because this is a very meaningful moment for me. <laughs> so what, what you're saying, if I'm, if I'm understanding, oh, there's the bus. Sorry. What you're saying, if I'm understanding correctly, is that Kim Kardashian was in a Fallout Boy music video. We were talking about Fallout and you believe in that video that she looks like a horse in, in that video. Is that correct? Her face. Yeah. And so you thought, I want Wubby to know what I'm thinking. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spam in chat in all caps. Hold on. I, I, I'm going to spam in chat horse Kim Kardashian. I want to make sure I understand. Is that correct? <laughs> yeah. Holy fucking shit, dude. Well, thank you, Paper Heart, for the explanation. I feel like I can finally sleep again. Restless nights trying to figure this out. And I will say in the future... All you had to say was, Kim Kardashian kind of looks like a horse in this video. <laughs> Are you, how, how do you feel that you created this meme? Are you proud of it? Is it cool for you? Um, my husband thinks it's hilarious. So, okay, yeah. Good. Are you like a, you're a local legend now, I assume, right? You go to the office and everybody knows that you're the horse <laughs> Kim Kardashian girl. All right. Well, yeah. uh, thank you so much. Well, I appreciate it. Uh, thank you for explaining. I, well, I'm I, have, up, I have the official image. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye, paper. Thank you. Bye. Bye, bye. chat. Bye. Oh, bye. Oh, she was so sweet and so stupid. That is. Can we really say we're even disappointed? What are we, chat? What emotion are you feeling right now? Are you disappointed? It's nice to know, but it's almost absurd what it is. Closure. You know what? That's a good one. Closure. That was. And here is, here is the image in question the origin of horse kim kardashian ladies and gentlemen without further ado <laughs> I, I i mean i guess <laughs> i dude i love that woman i love her can I really just say I love her? Her explanation is so fucking funny. Yeah, she looked like a horse in the video. So for the next two hours of stream, I wanted to make sure you saw it. So I just spammed horse Kim Kardashian. I just kept spamming it. Like, it's like, how high was this woman? It's <laughs> so pure. Well, there you go. God, look at that. We learned something fun. Uh, horse Kim Kardashian. It's put to rest. Uh, we did Mr. Teeth. Language of the slaves. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I know what this is. Uh, once again, one of my favorite movies that we referenced earlier, Hey O'Connell. It's from the movie The Mummy. This is also a quote from the movie The Mummy. And it's a quote, I think, uh, I, I 
I quoted it on stream, and it's a it, out of context. It's a it's a pretty bad sounding quote. Uh, in context, it makes sense in the movie, but the quote is. Uh, there's a character who hears, uh, I think, Hebrew, and he goes, ah, language of the slaves, like a slave people. Cool, I can use you. Uh, you quoted it, I quoted it during Cornhole, so I quoted it when I was hanging out with him. So Imhotep, who is an ancient mummy guy, uh, I'll just let you see the clip. Hold on, can I do the Chinese one too? He, he like holds up, I think he holds up like something Buddhist, and he goes, ba -ha, ba -ha, ba -la. and if you want to say that's racist, watch the clip first. Thank you. Am I racist or am I right? Come on, get it together, chat. Get it together. Thank you. Here we go. Here it comes. Here it comes. Ah, the language of the slaves. Okay, see, what's frustrating about that is that that was that I did not realize this was an edited clip. But you know what? I'll let you guys watch the movie yourself to hear Imhotep's delivery of this line. He also, I think, he says it in like some ancient Egyptian. He goes, "Oh, there's subtitles." Whatever. Anyway, I'll <laughs> I'll leave it at that. You guys can go watch the mummy. Go watch the mummy tonight if you haven't seen it. All right, LSF banner. Uh, this is a good one. A really short and easy one. I think I can show it on this scene unless I deleted it from everything. It's no longer useful. Uh, I think I still have it. No, I don't even think I have it anymore. There was a there was a there was a banner like a lower third like a like a news ticker like if you go watch the news and it gives you updates that I would put on the lower part of my stream whenever I wanted to talk about something that I didn't want clipped out of context. Why? Live stream fails a subreddit. Uh, uh, dedicated like streamer clips. Uh, I used to have a very bad relationship with them and they hated me and I hated them. And in order for them to not talk about me, uh, we would put up that, that ticker that basically showed posts from LSF because LSF had a rule that you couldn't put clips on their subreddit if the clip had images from LSF. So it was a way around it. LSF, unfortunately, uh, removed that rule, but fortunately LSF doesn't seem to hate me as much anymore and I don't really hate them at all. So it is what it is. Everything kind of just moved on. Um, you knew it was going to be a spicy take when the LSF banner was up. Yep. All right. We're going on to tier three. Oh my God. There's so many more tiers. We're going on to tier three, but the tiers get less populated as it goes on. Despite them looking crowded, it's, it's more stuff. Uh, all right. Tier three. T-Pain and the hentai car. Is there a clip for this? I don't think there is. T- Pain. Nope. Uh, so uh, I have a hentai car that I made, and uh, I'm going to be giving it to T-Pain. When am I going to give it to T-Pain? I don't fucking know, but I'm going to give it to him eventually. And that's really it. He wants it. He 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 definitely wants it, and I'm definitely going to give it to him. And, uh, you know, it is what it is. All right. Ready up. Ready up. Where is it now? It's just sitting. It's just sitting collecting dust. I still have it. So it's never going to happen? Nah. All right, 2.7K, huh? Who knows this one? 2.7K. <clears throat> so I was sent a Zimbabwean uh, million billion dollar note, and people, well, let's just see if the clip shows it. Whoa! One million dollars? Zimbabwe dollars? Wait, it's, it's Zimbabwe you money, suck. though. This can't go far. No, we're millionaires. Okay, hold on. You this, fuck everyone. No, no, I don't think this is a lot. <laughs> It's Zimbabwe. How far do you think a Zimbabwean dollar goes? How much is this? Twenty-seven hundred dollars. So there, there it is. There is the moment someone convinced me that it was worth twenty-seven hundred dollars or two point seven k, and I, uh, well, I believed it. No. no, it's not. Wait, what? Yeah, it turns out it was all a lie. It's fucking worthless. So now, anytime! I mean, it doesn't matter. Anytime I need a number, where the, anytime the answer is a number. It could be, a, it could be I could be asking for a phone number. Anytime the answer is a number, anytime, it's 2.7K. The answer is 2.7K. It doesn't matter. 2.7, 2.7. Do you still have it? It's somewhere on my, it's somewhere on my shelf. 2.7, every time. Um, so that's where it comes from. I think that gets used constantly. That gets used constantly. So I'm glad uh, you guys now know. All right, next one is the 24-hour stream. 
I've already showed that with Kenroy. Uh, I did. A tw I've done multiple. I've done two 24-hour streams, and I vowed to never do them again. Uh, they are. Uh, I might still do them. They're on uh, the highlight channel. Has a great edit of the 24-hour stream, and that's what it is. Okay. Wu Shang Chang Shuang Ming Zede Kiai. I love this one. So, this is. Well, let's let's see what the clip is. Everyone uses this now as like a look at how racist Wubby is clip in everything. If there's a if there's a media share and you want to donate a video of a Chinese man talking, guaranteed this clip will be in it. Uh, last 24 hour stream, I lived in a hotel. Do another one, please. Bro, it's crazy. Do you, do you own the hotel now? All right, here we go. You don't have the stream open because I'll tell you how. They are clicking on my face. They're clicking wait, on Wait, wait, this face. isn't it. This isn't right. What is this? What the heck is this? What the heck? Oh, wait, I clicked the wrong thing. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. Chad, I'm stupid. Here we go. Here it is. Now, here it is. This is titled Wubby Chinese OG Clip. Or if you'd like. So, so, okay. This doesn't give the full context. So I put in, I put in this translation thing. And then I said, or if you want the official pronunciation. And then I read the Google thing. I did not just make you know ominous Bing asian sounds i was li it's literally words okay so here it is um my favorite part is where i go zede that's a good part or if you'd like to be more politically correct wu shang chan zong wang swang meng ki yai wu che zing zede wi yai yu shi ni hei ki san shi zu hongo Bro, we should just do this for the whole stream, huh? Just, just, just watch these. Someone said committed. <laughs> I know this went on for about ten seconds longer than it should have, huh? Look at that! Look at that confidence sip. I know what I. I gotta watch it again. It's so funny. Correct. Wu Shang Chan Zhong Wang Swang Meng Kiai Wu Che Zing Zede. Why do I have it memorized? <laughs> So that is the Wu Shang Chen. You, that comes up a lot. That comes up a lot on this stream, I would say. Uh, cameo. I had a Cameo account. If you guys don't know what that is, people could pay me money for a message. Uh, I would read what they wanted me to say, or sometimes they'd be like, hey, could you be mean to me? Or hey, could you say this or do that? Um, Peanut, can you send me the other the, uh, the, the Cameo you found? I no longer do Cameo. I, I just kind of fell off of it. Um, let me see if I can. Peanut found a really good cameo that I'm I'm looking for now. Oh, here it is. I found it. Thank you, Peanut. All right. So here is a uh, the cameo is defunct, but here is a uh, here is a clip from when it was on. <clears throat> hey, I was paid by Brandon to make fun of you. He wanted me to cite things like your brother killing himself. Or your mom died. <laughs> Don't laugh. But I won't. Because that's not funny and that's vile. And you're fat. Really fat. <laughs> Kill yourself. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, um, there you go. Cameo. It was a good good time, good fun, good it was a, it was a hoot and a holler and we had a good time doing it. Uh all right. Meta threads. My old merch, uh, yellow steamboat, wah, boo, boo, eh. My old merch, uh, company person, people that we worked with, Meta Threads, who we cut ties with because of a disaster, uh, regarding their sizing. So we're going to actually show that now. Uh, Meta Threads are the people who made my, all my old merch. We no longer work with them. Uh, and the reason is, I will show you right here. We have new merch coming out that is not with MetaThreads anymore. But here is, a, this is all you need to know about the MetaThreads sizing issue, okay? You ready? So, uh, this is the merch I was shipped. Look at how happy I am. I'm smiling, I'm great. This is the merch I was shipped. This is a 2XL, okay? This is the merch you guys were shipped. This is the same size 2XL. Notice, how no longer happy I am. Notice how uh, uh, it's gripping every part of my body. Uh, so yeah, like I said, we are no longer working with them. That is who uh, Meta Threads is, was, whatever. 
Yellow Steamed Buns. Oh, wait, you guys can't see. Yellow Steamed Buns. Somebody just donated uh, under the gift sub name Yellow Steamed Buns. Uh, I think there's just a video. You guys have probably seen it already. Steamed Buns. Loading. Here's Yellow Steamed Buns. Let's watch it. Let's watch it. Let's watch it. Yellow steamed bun. Yellow steamed bun. Yellow steamed bun of northern Shangji. Yellow steamed bun. I'm from Kang Jiao Go, number one in Suede. My yellow steamed buns are the best. Yellow steamed bun. Uh, this just got donated a bunch on MediaShare. I don't know the origin of who or why. I think it was maybe Walsh. I don't know. But uh, there you go. So that's the Yellow Steam Buns. Newbin Jamin, bro. This is a good one. This is a good one. Uh, Newbin Jamin. Our, 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 let's see if we got a clip for this. Oh, here we go. Newbin Jamin, bro. You're going to be my reviewer. Please roast my Instagram. Oh, that's his Instagram name. What a bitch. Oh my God, you're so ugly. We'll see what he no, no, no. You're so ugly, bro. Literally, gross inside and out. Oh no, you're literally saying that. Nubin Jamin. <laughs> the absolute, dude, watching this in hindsight is insane. The absolute confidence of how I pronounce his name. If you don't know what's happening, just wait, chat. Fucking idiot, dude. Gross pants. Or New Benjamin. <laughs> so I, I <laughs> okay that's absurd dude i mean that's it's crazy it's it's really ridiculous honestly so there you go new that's all the context there is a, a, a viewer sent in by the name of new benjamin sent some stuff in i shit on him and and made fun of him and i pronounced his name new benjamin uh, and that haunts me forever. All right, Hamza Allah. So Hamza Allah is from um, the Sims stream, and I can use that now because if you've been watching stream, you know what the Sims is now. Here is Hamza. He just became a meme in the stream because he's such a goofball who really doesn't speak English. Hamza Allah. Very nice. Very Thank nice. you. Do you think your mother is upset? Oh, um, uh, mother, I am sleeping. I am go with you, baby. I know. He has not a clue what she's saying. He has no real way of communicating. Sexy time? Sexy? You want sexy time? Anyway, that's Hamza. He was from The Sims. He was a character that we all kind of fell in love with. Cheeto is alive! Whoa, 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 whoa. Cheeto's alive, but we already talked about Cheeto being dead. What are you? What's this then? What's this one? Let's take a look. You're freaking weird, Wubby. Did you see that guy in chat? Some dude just goes, you're freaking weird, Wubby. The fuck? The stream hadn't even started yet, dude. Man, he, dude, Cheeto cannot hang. He, look at how not happy he is at being picked up. He cannot, look at him, look at him. He cannot hang. So is Cheeto alive? Is Cheeto dead? Well, that's all the context we will be giving on this stream. Musically, whoa. Whoa, dude. That's, okay, what is, so musically was, musically now known as TikTok was originally the uh, social media app um, for like little short upload bullshit, dancing, mostly dancing, lip singing shit. Uh, and this is the video that started it all, right? Is this the video that started it all? Oh my God, 4.9 million views. Uh, Mom, I'm famous. This is the video. Oh, oh, there it is, the song, listen. Wait, I, I need to screen these. I probably shouldn't play this. But anyway, this is the video that started it all. Uh, 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 I made a video about what kids are really doing on Musical.ly and, uh, and yeah, it, it is it how to gay. Oh, I'm going to see what this says off stream. Hold on. 
Fried chicken, that's mom's yeah. got some fried chicken. Gotta eat my fried chicken, gotta eat my fried chicken. <laughs> oh, it's not bad. It's not bad. I thought it was going to be like racist. That was usually my go-to back then. Anyway, Musical.ly, uh, I do take credit for shutting Musical.ly down after my video went viral. Shortly after it went viral, they rebranded. Get fucked. Get fucked. And they took down my video. They tried to t That's how I know I was on their radar. They tried to take down my video. It got taken down and it was a whole thing. Go watch the saga. Go watch the whole saga. It's an interesting YouTube saga. But basically, they, they tried to take my video down. I fought them. The video went back up. And the next thing you know, Musical.ly's gone. It's now TikTok. So I take full credit for that. Blow me. It's my claim to fame. Blue Box Stream. What the fuck is the Blue Box Stream? I don't know this one. This is the... F oh. Okay. I know what this is. The, uh, the Blue Box Stream is in reference to me opening CSGO cases and only getting blues uh, on the entire stream, even though I spent thousands of dollars and we didn't pull a single red or a gold. So we're going to just leave it at that one. That one's recent. Spell beans right now or take the L. Let's see if we have a clip for this one. I think we do not. Do we have? Oh, we can't find the clip. So if somebody has the clip, I know somebody out there has the clip, but until then, I'm just going to describe it. A very old clip of me playing Fortnite. Somebody says, Wubby, spell beans right now or take the L. And uh, unfortunately, uh, in the heat of the of combat of Fortnite, I spelled beans B-E-N-S. And then shortly after, I died. And it's a great clip. And everyone makes fun of me. And it is what it is. All right. Pamity Wubby, MetaZoo Origin. This is a good one. So MetaZoo, you guys know the card game who uh, uh, I know the creator of. His name is Mike. And he was originally a fan. We've done a card collab with them since then. We have another thing coming out soon with them that I'm really excited for. But here is the origins of that. This is actually crazy because uh, in this clip, uh, this young Mike, this broke, young, aspiring card game creator sent one of his favorite streamers a bunch of sample cards. And what did I do? I shit on him. This is to um, Dennis, MetaZoo. Someone said, curse. These cards now are worth, uh, if, you, if they all get graded high, six figures, probably. By the way, I still have all of them, and I still, they've been kept in, I remember when, um, not 2.7k i remember when um mike uh came over late this is way now metazoo is really successful yada yada and i remember he goes yeah right elmo dude are you one of those people that's like cardboard doesn't have value uh, uh who's buying though guys uh, do i uh, how when will you guys f like come you, you know you want to we overuse this term okay but i'm going to use it for the first time ever properly the people who pretend like card games don't have value you are the definition of cope. You are the de you're the same people sitting there going, people are spending thousands on on pixels and Counter Strike. You're the same people. You are the definition of cope. I'm sorry. It's just the it's just the truth. It's just the truth. Anyway, long story short, I remember Mike came over and he goes, "You still got those cards I sent you like a long time ago before Metazoo was thing?" And I'm like, "Yeah, I do." And he's like, "Good, That's keep true. them. They're worth a fuckload now." Uh, anyway, so uh, I don't want to watch myself shit on him but yeah look dude you guys don't even realize any metazoo fans this is crazy to see look at this this is crazy like these are so valuable and they've just i, I didn't give a shit hey, thanks for the subs. it looks pretty cool dude <laughs> something like this is gonna matter if it takes off right you suck Yo! like i'm gonna hold on to these smart wubby smart <laughs> Here, here, take these two. Oh, Dude, you can that's so down. crazy. That's crazy. Why did you come on a walrus? What? Bro, you need to be kind to your mother, okay? She works hard. She works hard to keep you fed, okay? All right, so there's uh, origins of the Metazoo. Metazoo. Uh, okay, we got to get through some of these. Fabio's doing color. That's in reference to my tattoo on my arm. Fabio, who did my sleeve, does not do color. And when I got tattooed, he decided to put some color in. And it was such big news in his shop. Everyone in the shop that he owns was stopping by going, oh, 
Fabio's doing color? What the fuck? What year is this? What's happening? So, um, that's Fabio's doing color. Voicemail box? Is that just my mailbox for voicemail? Let me just see if there's anything. We have a, uh... A phone line you guys can call in and we have over yeah that's right we have over ten thousand voicemails we don't know what to do with currently but they're there dad's in jail dad's in jail there's a clip for this one i know what this is but i don't know if i know the origin of it so let's take a gander let's take a gander time is flying boys we might have to split this up into two streams and i know people the naysayers in chat the naysayers in chat are sitting there right now they're going i knew this would happen i knew this would happen <laughs> What is this? What is this clip? All right, here we go. What is this clip? All right, here we go. This one's very from... old, very old peel boxing stream. It doesn't say. Oh, wait, in here. Volumes at max. Hey, Wubby. I'm also working on an art project still from Lockwood. Yeah, shake off the rice in. <laughs> <laughs> okay. My dad is in jail. So I don't... Are you in a closet? Bro, this is my old room. What do you want from me? Why does my face look so red? What is the rosacea? What the fuck? Anyway, uh, I don't know. I don't think this is the origin of it, but I don't know why. Just a joke. My dad's in jail is something I would always say. Uh, and we turn it into merch. Very, very old merch. Uh, Alex has the beans clip, which I'm going to share with you guys now. Alex, where is it? Where did you send it to me? Tell me you didn't DM me on twitch you fucking idiot here it is here it is boys here is the spell beans or take the l clip spell beans right now or taking out b e n s why did i do that why did i listen to you what the fuck's wrong with me oh, here we go oh, fuck 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 what the fuck are you fucking it's 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 kind of like a perfect little like 20 second thing right everything goes wrong everything i'm even like mad that i spelled it and i'm like cocky about it why did i even listen to you meanwhile we're missing an a is what it is all right so there's that spell being taken uh uh where else are we uh blah, 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 spell being, uh, we did that. flare incident uh all right let's see the flare incident when i got this new house uh you know before there was speed there was there was wubby uh, and, uh, I put a lit flare into Alex's hand and lit it. And, uh, it really fucked up the house for a while. Get out, get out of the house, get it out of the house, get it out of the house, get it out of the house. She's so stupid. I don't know what she was doing. Like legitimately, she, I, like, okay, I'm sorry. I'm not sure what you mean. Alex, what the fuck? You're so dumb. What were you doing? She was going for a window, a window that can't open like that. You, it's, it's, there's a screen that doesn't move. I was going to throw it out the window. Alex, the win- <sighs> This, this damn near ruined that stream. I think we had to go offline. Nobody could breathe. And then here we go, iconic moment here. There it is. Also, I don't understand this. I wrote this down as a note here. Why is the top right say twitch.tv slash pokelols? What the fuck does he have to do with any of this? Nothing. This is, is this just miscredited? This isn't even uploaded to Pokelaws channel. What the fuck does Pokelaws have to do with any of this though? And I'm not trashing Pokelaws. I have nothing, I'm not saying anything. I'm saying, what does this have to do with him even slightly? So uh, yeah, there it is. But this was the first clip I found. It was just up there. So there's that. Uh, the escape room. Alex and I have done multiple escape rooms on stream, but the OG one brings us back to another meme who I don't think is on here, but we'll rope him into this one by the name of Stevenson. We went to a, an escape room where we met uh, Stevenson, who is now a character on stream. He's an emote on stream, and here he is. Um, Luna be acting. We were watching this, getting ready for stream. We were getting all these clips, and I was dying laughing at how... We were blinding Stevenson with lights, and I didn't really realize it till after stream, but watching this over again, oh my god, it's so funny. Thirstier than the state of California. Is it okay that I have a light on? I want to... Hello? <laughs> there he is! I don't know what we do. Well, let's read. I think he wants us to sit down. 
Wasn't this such a fun stream? I don't know. Help this man is a serial <laughs> killer. Help this. It was a good. It was a great stream. Maybe not the best visually. Maybe you know whatever. But I'm so you know I'm nostalgic for my own content. Okay, and I'm nostalgic for that. Uh, all right. What the fuck? Okay. I'm sorry, chat. Y'all are suckers. Okay. Five thousand dollar dono goal. Go buy a plant. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to stream, baby. What else do you expect here? All right, um, so that is the escape room. Fake Taxi was a stream we did. I think we only did it once, which by the way is crazy. We should seriously do it again. It's a great idea. Um, it's a stream idea where I basically would bring viewers on via Discord and I'll fuck the shit out I'm of them. I'm not feeling generous right now. <laughs> okay. I I'm gonna fair, take that fair, from fair. you. It's, it's Harry and it's Marv. Isn't you that what I said? You said Merv. Oh. Um, I, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, I, I, okay. Chad is saying he said Marv. Chad, do we want to give it to Tony? I'll give it to Tony. It's fifty bucks. Is that a bucks. Porsche? He said it. If what do you I think? Can give you something that'll that'll be on my side. I'm your only so, active. The thing is about that. I want to do. I don't know why we did. We only do one or do we do two? Do we do one or did we do two of those? We need to do more because that was a great stream. And I hope you guys see it. it's on YouTube. That's all it is. There's nothing deep about it. It was just that. Uh. Ah, this fucking thing. All right, the next one is the word epitome. Uh, the word epitome, which we're gonna. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Hold on, I gotta. So I very famously, fam I say famous as in this stream famous, uh, mispronounced it to this. Epitome. Uh, <laughs> So I w we couldn't find the clip, but the original Fortnite clip, someone donated something or, or something, and I was like, oh, that is the, that is the, or I, said, I was reading it, and I read it as epitome. Now, I want to be clear here. I know the word epitome. I know how to use the word epitome conversationally. When I saw it written, I read it as something not epitome. I read it as epitome, and I'm like, I don't know what that word means, right? And I want to be clear. You guys have fucked me up so much with this. I'm so insecure about this. Okay, this is the epitome of embarrassment. Am I using that right? But regardless, regardless, regardless. Even now, as I look at this word, my brain first goes epitome, and then I have to manually go and change it to epitome. So this word is very triggering for me. Even now, I'm looking at chat, and I go epitome. It's crazy. All right, uh, poker stream review. Uh, so the, we did an America's Card Room stream. Uh, a while ago. We did one this Monday too, but the first one we did, the subreddit didn't know how to feel. They were Some people were mad, some people were rationally annoyed, and some people were happy with it. Basically, some people went crazy though, as the subreddit does, and took it way too far and, 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 and really, really attacked me for doing a poker stream. Uh, and one of the biggest criticisms, I dedicated an entire stream to going through criticisms, Okay, and one of the biggest criticisms that I received really pissed me off, and it was that America's Card Room is a scam. Look at their Trustpilot reviews. There were thousands of reviews on Trustpilot. A lot of them were one star. So I, being extremely autistic, decided one day to go through every single review on Trustpilot, every single review, and categorize each review into multiple categories. Basically, long story short, through doing that, we determined that most of the one-star reviews, it was something like 90% of the one-star reviews were because people lost money and believed the site to be rigged, which is something you will find at every casino. Basically, losers bitching. I systematically shit on everyone on that subreddit who was bitching that the site was unsafe. So long story short, it shut everything down, and I haven't heard a single fucking peep for the new uh, uh, poker stream because I think people understand that at the end of the day. I don't draw the line at advertising poker, and I think people understand if they don't want to watch, they don't have to watch. Uh, it was weird as fuck how thorough you did. Have oh, a good job, you did. Thank you. It was, it was, it, it was important to me, dude. Um, people were saying like Wubby's whole team is a con artist. They're promoting a scam. It's like, listen, you don't have to agree that you can you can sit here and draw the line at poker and that's well within your right i had no problem with that people were saying that like my whole team were con artists that they, we were promoting a scam website that they, we were evil we need to be held accountable for it anyway uh tiny hands uh we already kind of touched on that back when i was uh uh like early stages green screen i use tiny hands a lot because you can't see my hands uh and that's really it uh funerals funerals I think I have the first funeral ever. 
I think I have the first funeral ever. So as you guys know, when any uh, in current day, what are funerals on the stream? When somebody dies, uh, uh, is this a, when somebody dies on my stream, we do a funeral scene, and I think the scene has stayed the same for years. Yep. So there's the last death that was uh, uh, important enough to me to get a funeral. And maybe, chat, if one of you guys die, put it in your will that Wubby will do a funeral. One thing that's important, uh, that a bit of a meme now with funerals, is I always give the wrong name and I always use the wrong picture. But it's always close enough for you to know who I'm talking about. Sometimes it ends up being accidentally racist, but I promise we do it for white people. We do it for everybody. I've seen people get really mad, like, what, what are you saying? What are you? It's like, no, we always misname the person. We always give the wrong photo. So... With that being said, I think this is the first funeral. Um, I think this was when I was like quitting YouTube to be streamer. I'll finish the story. Look at oh God. Also, it is the same background. Nothing has changed in all of these years, dude. That is fucking crazy. Okay. <laughs> what is dead may never die, but rises again harder and stronger. I don't even know what this is. What I'm doing here. So long story short. I'm sitting on my couch, watching. What is stream? Oh, what you guys it? can't hear that, but I can still hear it. Anyway, you get the point. There it is. I'm sitting here stroking my dick. That's funerals. Boom, hamum, shabai. Goblin band in chat. Okay. Uh, do you still have the PNGs on that screen? I do. So this one's good. Peanut had to explain this one to me because I did not know. The word goblin is banned in my chat. And I didn't know why. I said, I said, Pino, what's the goblin band in chat? Like, what's the meme behind there? And he goes, well, the word goblin uh, is or was, I don't know if it still is, banned in your chat. And I said, why is the word goblin banned in my chat? Like, that's part of my branding. Like, my MetaZoo card is the green goblin. I, like, goblin doesn't offend me. And he goes, well, there was at one point, a lot of people were spamming pedophile goblin. So we clicked it and we banned it as a term. So it also took goblin down with it. <laughs> And I found, he told me that today and I found that so fucking funny. I'm like, all right, keep it. That's kind of good. It's kind of a better story. Still banned. Why? There's no reason. Absolutely no reason. I think it's funny. I don't know. It's kind of a funnier story than you guys being able to use the word goblin. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even have a word with, I don't even have a problem with pedophile. I call you guys pedophiles all the time. I don't know. It's just a better story. Uh, mods, if you want to unban both words, I don't care. I didn't ban them in the first place. Mods, if you want to unban them, it's up to you. I Let me make this very clear. Legitimately, you decide. Chat, decide with the mods. Mods, decide with the chat. I don't care. But either way, I thought it was a funny story. The Coke Zero can. Uh, do we have... No, so I, I don't have a clip, unfortunately. But behind me on the shelves behind me, there sat a Coke Zero can for months it sat there for months uh at one point it got replaced with a cardboard cutout of a coke zero can it was very weird and then it was replaced with the can again very weird that can sat there for a very long time and now it is gone and i don't know where it's gone to but it is gone uh maybe we'll see it again one day yonkers yonkers onkers from fucking yonkers dude there was a character on the 90 day fiance show that we were watching i mean on the sims that we were watching who had big tits and she sold her titties, or at least photos of them. And she was from Yonkers, so chat deemed her fucking honkers from Yonkers. And then we just shortened it to Yonkers. So there's that. All right, HP's full name. Um, HP is my hairless kitty that you guys know and love. We all love HP. HP's full name doesn't get said often. In fact, some of you might not even know it. Is Goblin Freed? Can you guys say Goblin now? Poopy Daddy, thank you for the five. HP's full real name on his vet documents is HP Office Jet Pro 6978 wireless all-in-one instant ink ready printer as voted by chat, I believe. Uh, so there you go. That is HP's full legal name. Hot Tub Grapes. I don't know this one. Hot Tub Grape. It's a video. <laughs> Hot, what is this? Hot Tub Grapes? Oh, wait, I, of course I know this. Oh, okay, okay. I I am the grape. I see, okay. Here's hot tub grapes. Are you pre-wine? Oh, you forgot your hat. I'm the, I'm wearing the hat. Oh wait, I'm, where's my hat? Oh my God, hold on. <laughs> Are you pre-wine? That's a good question. Hold on, hold on. Should I get on? Bro, we yeah, killed these streams. <laughs> we killed these streams, bro. Oh my 
my gosh. She didn't want to be the she didn't want to be the cool the cool grapes. Oh, you know? oh wait, oh wait, I, I know what I'm about to be. I, there's a big joke coming. There's a big joke coming. Big joke coming, chat. Big joke. Get ready, get ready. I'm so proud of this one. All right. Oh, ladies, listen, 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 listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I did not know about this. All right, ready? Oh, ready? Um, ready? Yeah. Are you gonna dance? I'm sangria. Chat, come on, dude. If that's not worth your prime, like, where's it even going at this point? Come on. If that, like, if that's not worth your prime, like, what is, right? I'm sangria. I don't get it. You're fucking uncultured, is what. You know, I'm gonna spray you, dude. You don't get it. Hey, you know what? Pixel Dragon, you a real one. Thank you for the five. All right, all right. Hot tub weirds. Ghost hunt. I, so I saw this clip today. I forgot. This is so cool. I forgot we did this. Bruce Green, who, by the way, salt of the earth. Love that guy. Invited me on an IRL ghost hunt, phasmophobia style, in LA at some fucking scary, spooky thing. We did a whole live You're tapping. We did, did a you hear whole that? everything. It was super fun. Uh, I had a really great time. I love Bruce. I love everyone who was there. They were all really nice. So yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, Adam fine. was there. Oh, that's fine. That's totally. Fine. You know, if anything, that was probably. He was great. He was super nice. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna move on. But yeah, go uh, go. It's all on the highlight channel. It's not like that's too deep. But I think people forget about it. And it's a ghost hunt. You get what you get. But it was cool. It was cool seeing it again. I'm like, holy fuck, I forgot about this. All right. Um, floor watermelon. I see it. I'm looking right at it. I'm not going to touch it, but I'm just going to explain it. So uh, long story short, I was eating watermelon at my desk and a piece dropped and it sat there for a while. And then uh, it started to turn weird. So I turned the camera to it weeks later and I showed it to chat. And I'm like, chat, this watermelon has been sitting on the floor for a very long time. And then it became an experiment. We just started watching it and see what would happen. And then next thing you know, uh, I tried to get it off the carpet and I, it requires a screwdriver. I have to fucking like wedge it out of there. And it's just this weird situation. You guys want proof that it exists still? The floor watermelon definitely still exists. It's still on my floor. Haha, -ha, why though? Uh, maybe one day I'll uh, I'll auction it off, you know, and give the money to a charity, my charity, the one I control. Uh, okay, uh, floor watermelon. Cane suit. I fucking love this story. We were wanting to do a cane suit for streamer awards. So what did I do? I went to Cane's on Twitter. And what did I do? I hit up their DMs because their DMs were open. And I was going to say, let's do a cane suit. Let's do a sponsored cane suit for stream rewards. I thought that would be so good. But unfortunately for me, unfortunately for, why are you dealing, why are you handling that? It's a parasite. Honestly, it's not. It's just completely dried out at this point. Um, pedophile goblin is so freeing. You're welcome. So I went to Kane's Twitter to hit them up to potentially do a sponsorship deal uh, for a suit for stream rewards. But all of my... Uh, dreams were shattered when I saw I had a DM with Canes from over five years ago, pre-fame, pre-success, broke as a joke. That wubby, a young, early 20s wubby, DM'd Canes and said, hey, my order was messed up. It's my first time at Canes. I had such a bad experience. <laughs> so... As quickly as I rushed to Kane's DMs, I left with my head in my hands, knowing that I would never be able to work with Kane's ever again. So uh, that is the Kane's story or the Kane suit. Our place, uh, let's see if do we have, if you guys don't know what place is, it was the pixel placing thing that Reddit did. And my community got obviously very into it and it was a lot of fun and I can't click on this for some reason. There we go. 
And we got in the final screenshot, we got a lovely little, uh, we got a lovely little Wubby 7, and it looks great, and I love it. And whoever put this uh, black square here, uh, you better hope I don't ever run into your children, um, because I will keep driving if I do. So uh, there's that. Thank you. 27-month uh, resub. This is a good one. I have this one on my desktop. 27-month resub uh, is a, well, it's a GIF. Oh, wait, no, it's not on my desktop. I'm sorry. It's, I uploaded it. So the 20, why is the 27 month resub even uh, uh, noteworthy? Well, let's just look at it. It's a, um, well, here it is. I'll just show it to you. It's a little off the rails. So it's, it's tan face Wubby and Wubby making out. Tan face Wubby gets undressed. He gets thrown on the bed and God knows where it, it goes from there. That's the 27 month resub. The story behind it, if you're wondering, if you, if you don't know, I mean, I'm sure most of you know, but if you don't know, it is a parody, not parody, it's a, it's a, it's a reference to this. All right. So, uh, there's that, that is the 27 month resub. That's true. Can somebody play it? Is it even still on anymore? Do we still have that's true as a sound thing? Oh, I'm that's sorry. True. There it is. I forgot that AITTS was paused. Sorry about that, guys. Yeah, watched pot never boils. That's true. Irish Whoa. accent. Where is Mike? That's true. Where's Mike? Zhao Guo Xian Zai Wo, you being chilling, Wo Han Si Huan being chilling, Dan Shi Sudu. You jicking nine, be being killing Sudu, you jicking Sudu, you jicking nine, Wo Zui Si Huan Suo Yi. Xian Zai Shi Yin Yue Shi Jian. The only scammer is Yeb. Zhao Shang Hao Zhong Guo, Xian Zai Wu Yu Bing. I suffer from really bad OCD, and when I have bad episodes, I watch you live or VODs from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for making life easier to manage. Beep. To all my place comrades, Thank just you, remember man. fuck France and their fucking bots. Thank you, man. Hey, son, I think I'm going to start One Piece. Let me land. There's this character named Sanji M. His dream is to find the mythical All Blue, a place in the ocean where all four seas meet. Apparently, the All Blue contains every fish in the world, making it a dream location for a master chef. Imagine it sun every single fish. Plus, there are even fish people and mermaids. Hi, okay. friends and planet Earth deity. It is Wednesday, June 26th. Whoa, that's the this video! Mind okay, weird. The child All right, soul. so Today, I made a video we're going to be discussing on... the Angelic Initiative. That's correct. I made a video on the Angelic Initiative. It's one of uh, my favorite videos. I then flew out to meet them. It was a whole crazy thing. Long story short, if, if you don't want to go watch the video, uh, one of the two, Miss Jamie here, would always say, that's true, and it became a meme in the stream for a very long time. The intrusions from above continue. That's true. There it is. So there you go. It's kind of weird hearing it now. I'll be honest. It's it's a little surreal. Uh, please release the behind the scenes. I will. I will eventually. I need to go through them. I need to edit it. Whatever happened to her? Well, if you check in on their YouTube, last time I checked, they're still making videos, I think. I don't actually know. All right. Uh, Legoland. This is in reference to a stream we did from Legoland. Um, a lot of good memes to come out of the Legoland stream. Why won't it? Dude, what is happening? There we go. Is this just the VOD? I met the hot dog guy, which is really hype. Am I live? Yeah. Hello. Thanks. How are you? This is when Matt, 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 masks were mandated. Just so you guys know. Yeah, Legoland, baby. Yeah. By the way, we're at Legoland here testing the IRL backpack. You suck. <laughs> so, uh, uh, Legoland. Party 500, Wubby, hey, Wubbies, or right. myself, since I'm talking, I don't think Go to View is on there. Are you going to explain that? That's also, not my Go meme, to View, though. Go to View, Go to View. Go to View is, is Bruce Green and Funhouse, though. Like, you got to understand, like, I, uh, I hey, don't, Wubby, a, make sure yeah. you specify the good, the mummy that came out in 1999 with Brendan Fraser, and not the bad one with Tom Cruise that came out in 2017. I, you're right. I may look I, like I have it all, I, but I, deep I, down, I'm just a scared little boy who never learned how to ask for people's food or their birth. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to pause these again. Um, 
I, I, that kind of breaks my heart that I have to even clarify because it's the same thing with like old boy. When I recommend people go watch old boy, it's like that fear that what if they go like, I'm like, Oh, it's one of the best movies ever. You gotta go watch it. And then they go watch the fucking American remake of old boy. Oh, breaks my heart. All right. Next one. Penis gang. I was on Miss Kiff's, uh, uh, what was it called? Uh, uh, schooled and, uh, all the contestants joined together in order to break the show never giving an answer so the game would have to continue by drawing penises and we became penis I'll do the gentleman, that's fine. What the I, fuck? I could only remember Meta and Pro. CBC, Liquid, Wubby, and Visa Liquid. gift cards. None of you have any cheats, have absolutely nothing. If you talk, you're eliminated. That's just it. I When I read so the okay. question... This, this was Penis Gang. Also ruined by the cheater EE who cheated on the game and ruined it for everybody and stole everything. Penis Gang. Puffer Fish. This is a, a meme that's outside of the stream, but we also became pretty obsessed with it for a time. If you know it, make the noise at your desk. Here it is. Oh. Oh. God, I love it. I gotta hear it again. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's sad that he is literally about to get butchered. All right, uh, uh, neighbor, neighbor's kids have Yeezys. Oh, that's from the archery stream. Uh, during the archery stream, these kids that lived near uh, were rich, I believe. And I think they had Yeezys on or something. Let's see the clip. What was that? Tell me uh, yes. What did, what did you say? I got Did Yeezys. you make it? You got Yeezys? Yes. Did you make it? Are you hearing this? He said he got Yeezys. Oh, I thought he was clowning and saying that was easy. He just held up a Yeezy said, I got Yeezys. <laughs> He just held up a Yeezy and said, I got Yeezys. You were swearing at them? Yeah, fuck those kids. That's from the uh, archery stream, which you can watch. The, sorry, peak, the Pikmin Massacre! I love this one. This one's horrible, but I love it. I also love Pikmin. No, not pickle chin ass boy. That's not what I clicked on. All right, so I played Pikmin on stream. And, uh, well, something very unfortunate happened during a boss fight, and it has lived in infamy since then, so here is that clip. Well, ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to the first boss of the game. And first boss of the game is, is being, it's a hard boss, let me be clear, it's, it's scaled to where you are in the game anyway, so. And likely many gifted subs, I said five subs for every dead Pikmin. <laughs> this might be the last time we do this. This pick, this monster rolls to kill Pikmin. Bobby won't let Not us sure die. If went Make it one sub per Pikmin. Uh, I'll do that for for the future bosses. But I made a promise. Someone tried to warn me. Did you hear that? Someone tried to warn me too. They're like, "Make it one sub per Pikmin." So we'll keep it five because I'm a man of my word. Not a man of my word. I, dude, most of this stream is a lie. <laughs> You're so cute. I am overly attached to Pikmin. You know what, Chad? This is you. That's you, Chad. Look at you go. There's something about Pikmin trauma that hits different. get the point you get the point you get the, that is a hard clip to watch man i blew that shit uh that's the pikmin masker monkey ball two shortcut monkey ball two shortcut uh there is a map in monkey ball two i think it's is it monkey ball two uh there's a map that involves uh, uh getting a short you could do a crazy shortcut and i maybe made some promises uh, uh, about if I hit this shortcut, I'll give subs. I may owe a few billion subs. I'm not going to lie. Please resume TTS. Okay. Well, hold on. What the fuck is this clip? Oh, here it is. If you've watched this stream before, you know I will do this till I have zero viewers. What I'm about to do. True. This is it, though. Here we go. This is it. This is the one. I guarantee it. 
If I miss this, I gift one sub and we'll go up from there every time. We'll multiply it by two every time. One sub. Okay, we're at one. Two subs now. If I do this, I gift two. If I do this, I gift two. Okay, that's fine. Okay, if I miss this, four subs. We're at four. So we're going to skip ahead a little bit. Um, and I think it ended up with me owing. Let's see. Let's see if he did the math. I'm here to collect. Oh, we'll get to it. We'll get to it. We'll get to it. I'll pass it to my kids. It'll check the subreddit. Okay, I will. But uh, yeah, so that's the, that is the monkey ball. Uh, yeah, that is the monkey ball. That is the monkey ball. All right. He owes even more money than Germa. Is Germa in the same boat? I'm on the subreddit right now. What's on the subreddit? Okay. Innocent Elixir's painting me on stream. Yep. Hype. Looks good. Okay. Sick. Uh, what's on the subreddit? Oh, titties. Get deweed? Oh, Jesus. Okay. All right. All right. No, 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 no. We're going to enjoy the... We're doing the stream. We're doing the stream, chat. Focus up. All right. Uh, Emmett Clown Ban. All right, let's Emmett Clown Ban. I got banned from Twitch. I think... I think this was the, uh, the clown emote, and this is the... The one that I got banned from Twitch for doing a restaurant stream. I was live in a restaurant and they banned us because they thought we didn't have permission to film in there, which we did. Uh, and then I made a return to stream where I came out in a clown outfit and did a whole shtick that I think, I think it's still pretty icon. It's, you know, it's weird. People know me from that. There are people on, some people know me from Pope video. Some people know me from, you know, musically video. There are people who know me from the clown bit, which was just a dumb return to stream. Um, and yeah, there you go. It was my first stream, if I recall correctly. That, that's crazy. There you go. I had to manually type your name in. Oh, wait, never mind. Uh, okay, so that's uh, that's the clown thing. Speed dating. We used to do speed dating on the stream. Uh, we did one kind of recently, but uh, we used to do it when we had a very small community. And there are some deep VODs of that that I'm not going to pull up right now, but just speed dating, nothing crazy there. Uh, and Dominique. I had to find a clip from this fucking video that I could even show. But basically, as you guys know, I bought a sex doll on YouTube and uh, then took it to a photo shoot with me where the... Oh, God, is this going to be a band? Can I show her titties? I can't show her titties, right? Oh, I can't show this, though, I think. If we get banned, hey, if we get banned, we get banned, right, chat? Oh, this is it. Yes, dude. The fucking, uh, the photo shoot is so good. Risky video. I'll leave it here. I'll just leave it here. If you want to watch the full video, it is uncensored titties on YouTube because that was allowed. So you can go watch the whole thing there. Uh, this is one of my favorite fucking videos ever made. It's so funny. This video was such a failure at the time and I hated it. I hated it. And now I love it. I, it's one of the funniest things we ever made. We were supposed to do all this shit with the doll, and it just ended up staying in the garage, and it made for a better video. Love it. Uh, what did Alex say? Back when I was the camera person. Yup. All right, we are now on to the first level of deepness. How many more do we have? Ah, we're not going to finish tonight. We're just not. We're just not. But we're going to start to get to more deep shit here. Tyler's dad. I went to BJ's. The restaurant. It's not a sex thing. And I had one of the weirdest fan interactions I've ever had. Let's see if this video sums it up well. No, we're not going to end it here. I'm going to get through a few more. Jeez. Jeez. There were, by the way, if you guys are wondering, I'm pretty sure there were over 200 items on this list to get through. Uh, so we had, we used her removable vagina as a weapon during the making of Price of Scuff 2. We don't need to talk about that. Situation 10 times better. Oh, here he is. There he is, dude. Look at him. God, look at him. Would you just look at him? There's Tyler's dad. So Tyler was somebody who worked at the restaurant we were eating at, and Tyler was a fan 
of the content. So Tyler came up. He was very awkward and uncomfortable and whatever. And then he, for no reason at all, he said, oh, this is my dad. And this man <laughs> was just, man, it's, I don't even, it's really hard to remember because it didn't make sense the day after. But here it is. Okay, so Ash is, wait, hold on. Ash honestly made the whole situation 10 times better. Yeah, this is legendary. And then the, just the zoom in and he's like, yeah, I'll stare back. <laughs> so anyway, if you want the full context on Tyler's dad, there is the video on, on the Wubby archive. Just type in Tyler's dad. Um, but yeah, it was just this, I mean, God, it was just this strange interaction between a fan and his father. And it was weird and it was really funny. And Ash recorded him, and then the guy caught her, and it was weird. All right. Uh, Lord have mercy. This is not, this is, uh, we use this clip, but this isn't like a wubby thing. Uh, here's the origins of Lord have mercy. I'm about to butt. Hey, that was pretty good, huh? That wasn't bad, huh, chat? Lord have mercy. I'm about. Oh, I thought someone was playing the audio clip. I thought someone was playing it. Okay, that was weird. That was. <laughs> I, okay, I'm stupid. Sorry. Let's play it. Lord have mercy. I'm about to bust. There it is. Isn't that good? Isn't that good? There it is. Nothing more to it. We just, I thought it was funny. Timmy the Pedosaurus. We talked about this briefly the other day. The one time character that I brought onto stream because I thought it was funny. Lord have mercy. I'm about to bust. There it is. So here is Timmy the Pedosaur. Uh, this does not get referenced. Hold on, is that a knock at the door? Oh, I wonder who it could be. Is this the part? Thank you so much. It'd be so. Is that? You have. Go ahead, let us know. Okay, Timmy, go ahead, let us know. I think it should be socially acceptable to find children attractive. Okay. <laughs> you know, hindsight, you know what they say about hindsight, right? It's crazy. Uh, Wubby gets a paintball gun. So this one, uh, you know, again, what, what what is there to say? I had a paintball gun for a time, and it was it was a reoccurring character on stream for a time. Uh, and I used it to terrorize anyone around me, and eventually we got shot with it. It hurt real bad. But here is the first day I got it. That paintball gun got a lot of action, and it hurt like Fuck when we got shot with it on stream. That was horrible. Uh, chocolate anus. Chocolate anus. I am trying to go through these now because I want to get them all in one night, but I don't know if we're going to be able to. Uh, I molded my butthole on stream, by the way, never been done before, and Critical became keen to it. He wanted me to send him my butthole mold chocolate edition. Uh, we never ended up doing it because it was a big process that wasn't actually as real as we thought. This is my introduction to you, Wubby. Well, here you go. Over this Wubby idea. There. But I feel like I have to for the boys at this point. Eat. Do it for me. I want to taste his ass. Like, I haven't had an edible anus That's arrangement really before, and I've always like, wanted well, to yeah, try I one. Just... Critical is watching. I've heard. I've heard. And you guys aren't helping. You're just making this more nerve-wracking for me. Stop telling me he's watching. I know he's watching. At least just get close to the asshole design. Right. It doesn't... <laughs> what a surreal stream. I mean, this whole thing is just really bizarre but that happened we it was a whole you can watch the whole thing online a lot of these are like streams and i would suggest if it's all interesting to you go watch the whole thing uh okay where were we uh chocolate black kid <laughs> beeping there is no joke here uh uh there's no streaming here i just loved this and i told chad i loved it and then um you guys started donating on me share i think um but this is it it's just black kid beeping Just a meme. I don't know. I love it. Uh, the sleep stream. I did a sleep stream one time that ended with me getting uh, awoken up uh, with um, water, and I hated it. I really hated doing the sleep stream. 
and I really never want to do it again. There is a full highlight of it too. Um, yeah, this is where you guys found out I sleep with a towel, mouth guard, and eye mask. Boys, good evening. Look at me getting ready for bed, huh? Look at that little cozy boy right there. Look at how cozy I look. I got my little Snapple, and then is this the is this the big moment here? You know what's crazy? This <laughs> look at her. This stream was kind of people got controversial about this. That is where Jacob slept for Price of Scuffle, and that's right. This guy, this this people got controversial on this one. People were like, "What a piece of shit for doing a stream like this." We never did it again. She kind of misses here, but it still gets me. <gasps> I got, I, you know, I became primal. I mean, really, it's a horrible experience. It really is, but you can watch the whole bot if you want. There it is. Um, Wobacado. What is the history of the Wobacado? Oh, okay. We got a Reddit link here. That's how you know. Okay, redirecting. Dude, this is it. So if you guys spam the Wobacado email, this is what it comes from. A Redditor posted this. A Redditor posted this. Wobacado. And that turned into, we made merch, we made email. By the way, one of my favorite emotes is Wobacado. Thank you very much. That's it. And you can even tell this is old. You can tell this old because look at the camera that he pulled from. You can tell that's like the old shit. Wobacado. There you go, folks. Um, N Ward. N Ward. N Ward. N Ward Hitler was the name I said I would name my child if we did like a huge dono goal for it. So I've had this idea for years and I still kind of have it. When I have a child, I believe, and I believe this because um, I would have wanted this for my father. If my dad would have said, hey, son, you are named Enward Hitler. You're named Enward Hitler, right? And when I turn 18, my dad goes, hey, all that torture, all that horrible shit, there's a reason for it. Here's $5 million. I would have been so fucking stoked, right? So here's the idea, chat. If we do a huge dono goal, multi-million dollars, right? To name my first child, Enward Hitler, I think that's worth it. Now, a lot of people have voiced concerns, right? A lot of people said it's not worth it. It's, ab it's abuse. Bro, I wish I would have been abused like that. Are you kidding me? So anyway, that's Enward Hitler. Ooh, a lot of people voicing concerns. Okay. All right. Milk Tendies is up next. There's literally laws against it, Wubby. Bro, law this dick. Uh, Milk and Tendies. This is a reference to the stream that led to the clown stream. I believe. There. Here it is. Wow. Dude, I haven't seen this in so long. Wow. This stream is what got me banned. This stream is what uh, got... My, okay, this was such a breach of uh, of TOS according to... You guys think I look that thin here? Really? I thought I looked terrible just now. You guys are actually kind of making me feel good. Um, this stream apparently was such a breach of Twitch TOS according to them that they pulled it live. They pulled the stream live uh, because it was so... Yeah, there you go. There's Skinny Webby. Um, this will get you banned again. No, it won't because this is, this wasn't TOS. We had permission to be there. You look like your dad. Uh, but in this stream, Milk and Tendies, we had chat set up to a TTS thing and we told the staff that, uh, it was an AI. So we had you guys order food and you guys ordered Milk and Tendies, of course. So that's where Milk and Tendies comes from. What a crazy stream. I can't believe I got banned for that. Uh... Uh, gimp suit wasn't a gimp suit. It is a latex suit, which people do not forget about. We purchased a latex suit and we tried to um, squeeze myself into it for a stream. It did not work. I could not get into it. So we decided to shelf it and uh, do it another time. But here is that attempt. We definitely were not prepared. We did not have baby powder or enough. We did not have, uh, we, we were not prepared. Um, but here is uh, a clip from it. Thank you. 
going to move on from that. Wubby's grocery job. There's not one here to explain other than I used to work at a grocery store, so I reference a lot of things from there. Some people might not know that, but that was my first job. I, I worked at a grocery store, and it made me the man I am today. Cold and, and wealthy and powerful and hating people named Andrew. Uh, Nuka Zeus! One of my favorite videos. Uh, the man who turned himself... Uh, uh, from black or from white to black using tanning injections. Nuka Zeus, uh, love the guy, salt of the earth. Uh, just an old YouTube video I made, but here is my favorite part from that video. Uh, keep in mind, Nuka Zeus has tattoos that say black power and fuck whites. He is a white man who has those tattoos, and here is my favorite part from the video. Tonight, tonight, I do what it do, my boys and girls. On my left arm, we got the black power. You know what it do, we got the fuck whites on the other one. Represent on my left arm, here we got. I'm not particularly fond of Asian people, okay? To be honest, they make me uncomfortable. Mexicans? <laughs> so I guess this is a twofer because Mexicans was also a meme for a while on stream. Oh god, I love that video, it's so good. Uh, okay, uh, forklift. Oh my god. I know what it is. What was the origin for this? I think it's TT. So I got into a, a internet beef with Life with Mac, if you guys remember her even. And I think TT just as a joke, when we were when we were arguing with her on Twitter, he said, just start tweeting this photo out at her. And then everyone started doing it. And she's like, it didn't it, nobody understood it, but we just rolled with it. So there it is. This is the for I believe this is the origin of forklift, uh, right there. And her t Twitter, of course, has been deleted since then. Imagine, dude, what a time, what a time to be alive. Me, a man in my twenties, was beefing with a child. Isn't that crazy that we all did it and we all loved it? All right, Chris Angel. This one is heartbreaking for me. This one's hard for me to kind of wrap my head around. I told we were talking about Chris Angel on stream, and how I was a huge fan of Chris Angel uh, when I was a kid. So we started going back and watching Chris Angel magic videos and to my absolute shock we discovered live that chris angel had been faking magic tricks Before and this begin, video particularly fucked us up uh we basically broke this shit down frame by frame frame and literally and i shit you not we and I, I don't use this word lightly we proved that this shit is fake using camera tricks and editing it cuts uh, it, 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 it's, it's heartbreaking. I'm just going to show it again so I can get mad about it again. But basically the whole stream turned into me shitting on Chris Angel. Actual fucking con artist. I'm so mad at this fucking loser. Yeah! 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 Shut the fuck up, dude. You're a fucking loser. You're a nobody hack fraud loser. Alright. Ho's mad. Ooh. Oh boy, I almost don't want to open this one up again. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. What's the clip? Uh, I got into a bit of a Twitter argument with some ladies, and I came back to stream. Um, so this girl got in my DMs and threatened like legal action because I was making fun of her, and she here anyway. Here's this. Okay, the fork looked pretty good though. The f we got her with that though, huh? We got her with that. <sighs> That's good. That's actually really good. I that was a good clip. I will say though, I okay. Ash said I missed this wubby. I'm gonna tell you why I don't. Because that that wubby was stressed. Fighting with everybody gets tiring. Uh, did her lawyer ever contact you? Believe it or not, guys. Believe it or not, 
Uh, no, I never got any contact from any lawyer ever. You know, and also watching that back, like I don't even agree with what I was. I was, I was. This was uh, years ago, and I was getting on the case of some female streamers for being like basically booba streamers, which in 2023 I do not give a shit about anymore at all. Um, it was an amaranth. It was a stupid. I mean, she was. To be honest, though, like even though that was a cold take on my on my part, her response to it was just such a fucking embarrassing L. People who threaten legal action because of getting clowned on Twitter is just unbelievable, L. Um, yeah, she, her lawyer didn't reach out because he doesn't fucking exist. All right, Ram Ranch. Ram Ranch. Ram Ranch. Uh, Ram Ranch was just a really old stream meme. It's a song uh, that we would always listen to. It inspired uh, the ranch as well in the emotes. Um along with other things, but we just, this used to get donated a lot. I used to play this a lot, very early stream. Here it is. Eighteen naked cowboys in the showers at Ram Ranch. Big herd throbbing cocks wanting to be sucked. Eighteen naked cowboys wanted to be fucked. Cowboys in the showers at Ram Ranch on their knees wanting to suck cowboy cocks. Ram Ranch. You get the point. All right. Wubby, King Wubby at Denny's. This has been forgotten, but I fucking love this. It's very self explanatory. You get exactly what the title is. I went to Denny's dressed up as a king and I got knighted by the, the, the waiter. It was so cringe. It was amazing. And this one's been totally forgotten a time. Stop falling. Oh, I'm sorry. I knighted the waiter. You know, they say that all men are created equal. Oh my god, this is so painful. This is just actually unbelievable. You look at me and you look at Samoa Joe, and you can see that statement it's frozen. is not- It's frozen, it's good that it's frozen. And then I ate a whole meal? I ate a whole meal like this? Thank you. Well, we're not made of money, so- Are we going to Hooters? <laughs> we're not made of money, so- Hold on, where's me coming out of the- Oh, here we go. I love this clip. This is the best clip ever. This is the best clip ever. Ready? There he is! <laughs> <laughs> the double dab, baby. Who's the girl in this? What's well, another item we will be getting to shortly? There he is. The wah, wah, wah. I love that king costume, by the way. It's so sick. Pre cum. What the fuck's pre cum doing on here? What is it like pre like Earl? What is the difference between Earl and and pre cum? What about what about the producer who bailed on the price of scuffed? Oh, wow, that's crazy. What a deep cut. That's crazy. Earl had, Earl had hours. Pre-cum was just an hour before stream. All right, there's pre-cum. Stevenson, who we talked about already. That was the, the guy at the escape room who I showed you. Pickle chin app boy. Similar to black kid beeping. Is there, is it the same kid? Is pickle chin app boy the same as black kid beeping? I actually don't know. Nope. Nope. Sorry. Uh, why are there so many low quality black children yelling at cameras? Racist? My brother, this is not a human. This, what is this? This is a meatball for all. I have no clue what this is. <laughs> I don't even understand why this is on the list. All right, yeah, yeah, I get the yee, yeah, yeah, whatever. All right, so uh, let's pick a chin up, boy. Uh, black, we couldn't find a source on it. We couldn't find a start on this, but I do know what it is. For a long period of time, I would say the word black no matter what it was. I would say black. I still kind of do. I still kind of black. What's the joke? I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know where it came from. I don't know how it started, uh, but blank. Stayed around for a while. Producer, <clears throat> uh, former stream character. Uh, you saw her there holding the camera. She was the camera girl for a while. OG, OG, it was my sister. Uh, sister X uh, from uh, many, 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 many. God, what seems like ages ago. But yeah, that's her. 
Uh, you saw her in that. Wubby Donald Duck, which is photo, the photo is here. Hold on, is there a video for that? There is. What did we do the Donald Duck for? I mean, Alex would paint my face from time to time, as you can see here. Uh, oh, it was for Halloween! It was a Halloween thing we did! She's your ex-sister? Yeah, we, we dislocated her, or whatever it's called. <laughs> is that what it's called? I don't know. Pussy and okay, let's, let's, let's get this high quality. Let's bring this back. <laughs> I'm giggling. She comes up to us like this. She's like two feet from us, pussy and asshole out like this, just fucking clapping her legs and shit. What do I do? Throw some fucking dollars on her pussy. What in God's green earth am I fucking talking about in this, bro? What in the world is the context for this, bro? And I love that I'm doing it, whatever this vile conversation is, with this fucking, with this, this little makeup on. This makeup is in reference to that kid who, there's a kid, there's an image online, whatever. Uh, okay, uh, da da da, -da. Uh, Wubby Balloons. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, so I'm not gonna give too much context on this one. Uh, is she still around, by the way? Does she still do shit? I mean, anyone, people, oh, I don't want to start beef. I'm a good boy now. Actually, never mind. So this is the only context I'm really going to give. I'm just going to, we're going to move on from that. I don't want beef. I don't, I, you know, a younger Wubby would have said a joke that that older Wubby just thought of and moved on. Okay. All right. So, uh, 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 all right, this next one is called Grandma in the Back Seat. And instead of uh, telling you about it, I'm just gonna read you a story. So, and something maybe you all can agree, or you can relate with, right? So, don't you hate it? You're just driving along, maybe you're driving to work and you're smoking a cigarette, and you flick the cigarette out your window, right? A couple minutes go by, you're driving, 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 and you start to smell, you start to smell something funny, you're like, oh fuck. So you look back, you look over your seat, and. Yeah, sure enough, Grandma's fingering herself again. <laughs> this disgusting copy pasta has been used now for months, years, nay, on this stream. Uh, and basically, the goal I've noticed is that we just use it to bait um, anything, any story. It has to end with Grandma fingering herself. Uh, it's horrible. Years, years. Uh, uh, Bernie Mac, Bernie Mac, is he in this one? There he is. He's on the bus. You can see Bernie Mac. He's not in the back of the bus. He's right there, which is great. Uh, what is the story behind Bernie Mac? See, chat, I wish I could give you a reason that I'm aware of. Um, the only reason I know, Bernie Mac has been on this stream for years, since one of my earliest streams. Why? I don't know. Uh, there's really not... Uh, a Bernie Mac uh, reason. It's just, it was, yeah, it was like an Eddie Murphy joke, I think? I don't know. I don't know. And it's stuck. I know that's weird. I don't know. Uh, okay, what else? What, someone said I skipped something. Wubby Donald Duck? No, that's this dude. You, you, I did. Where were you a second ago? All right. We have, we have four more tiers. Uh, no, but I don't want to, I don't want chat to get, I don't want chat to get lore fatigued. You know what? Four tiers is, I would consider deep iceberg, and we can save it. We're going to save it. We're going to save it. I'll give you... Okay, I'll give you one. Chat, pick one. Pick one. Pick one. Can we finish TTS before... You really want your TTS heard, don't you? We're never going to finish it? Yes, we are. I promise. I promise we are. I promise we will. I promise we will. Well, hold on. I don't want to end yet. Hold on. I'm not ending yet. We're going to pause the, the, the lore iceberg right here we got okay i want some we got through all of this okay it's a lot of lore it's a lot all we have to get through is this now down here all right um but wait don't leave don't leave hold on hold on hold on hold on peel boxes this friday hold on hold on hold on hold on hey i need help my power armor suddenly stopped moving and fall out how do i recharge it open up console um, we gotta end stream with some cases. Do we not? Like, are we not doing this, guys? 
I thought you promised me we would. You promised me we would always end stream with cases. And guess what? Our boy Kisa World, Kisa World, has graciously given us a few more cases. Ladies and gentlemen, let's do it. Let's get started. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the lore stream. Um, we're not done. We're gonna get through more. But uh, I'm <clears throat> I'm feeling lore fatigue. I genuinely uh. The, the last few two, I'm, I'm finding myself rushing through them to get through them, and I don't want to do that. And all we have is time. We'll be live Friday with P.O. Box unboxing, though, um, which is going to be fun. All right. Counter Strike is open. Let me make it. Uh, hold on. Let me make it. Okay. I hope you guys learned something, though. I hope you guys learned something today. I have to buy keys off, off screen. I don't want you guys to see that. Hope you learned something. I did. Good for you, man. Good for you. I'm happy for you. Add funds. Man, I got to add funds. We only have a few cases. Like I said, we're only going to do a few every stream until we pull a knife. Okay. How's the subreddit looking, guys? Is it on fire? Let's take a quick glance at the subreddit. Okay, I'm on the subreddit. Okay, I'm sorting by new. Okay, I'm Flounder. Okay, Origin of Black. Okay. Check Donos. Okay. Checking Donos. Look at the Donos. Checking Donos. $10. He said same Wobby. What am I looking for specifically in Donos? Dingle Dingle Newt Newt. Thank you for the five. What am I looking for? Well, you DM me. That's a boys' night. No, 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 no. All right, you ready? Here we go. Skip. I'm taking off the green screen for this. You guys ready? Can you show us the knife skins you already have? Sure, I'll do that after. All right, you guys ready? It's time. Seven cases from Kisa World. <clears throat> Wubby, can I borrow $350 to pay a bill until next Wednesday? I'll give you $400 back. What in God? What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm, I'm, I'm sick. What are you doing? What are you? I'm worried about you, man. I believe him. I'll be honest with you. I don't. I don't. I would do that without even questions asked. If it was a friend, a close friend of mine, I would do that question. No, but the problem is you're going to take my money and you are going to run. You're going to take my money. And you, you know how I know that? Because you're in a situation right now where you, you, you how did you even get in this situation? You're, I, I, you know, and how do I find you if you run? How do I find you? Where do I even go? People are saying, hold him accountable. Who is this guy? How do I hold someone accountable like this? You know what? You send me a photo of your ID. Your that won't even stop you, motherfucker. Not a, I, I'm realizing now, there's nothing that would stop you. I could have your socials. I could have everything. And you would still take it and just run. Like, what are you going to do? What am, and the worst thing, too, 350 bucks. Is it enough to, like, really come after you, right? If it was, like, 10 grand, I'd, I would hunt you down. I would hunt you down. The cost of a human life to me is $7,000. I would hunt you down. Okay. All right, let's get to, we're almost done. We're almost done, boys. Man, 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 man. Three more, man, man, man. God, imagine how cool of a streamer I would be if I flipped a butterfly right now. Can you even imagine how cool of a streamer I would be? Everybody, everybody take your hands and just put your hand on your screen. Ladies, put your tits on you the suck. screen. You <laughs> suck. Everybody take your hand right now and just put your hand on the screen. My hand's on there. Here we go. Ready? Here we go. Here we go. I feel it. That's it. That's it. Everyone just put their hands together. This is the one. Man, that really, that's painful. It's more painful that way. Last case. Remember, guys, if I don't hit gold, I end stream. Until next time, until Friday. Thank you. I had a long day today. I'm going to go jerk off in a Kane's bathroom.
and then I'm going to uh, eat my food in my car and weep. So I hope to see you guys there. Here we go. Last box. Here we go. Thank you again, Kisa World. If you guys want to send me cases, I will open all of them. Here we go. Oh! oh!